Hello everyone, welcome back to another Fallout 4 stream. Alright, let's crack on. Get a few things done and then we're off to find Kellogg. Ah. Uh. We also need to try and finish off the Brotherhood side quest and finding all the distress signals. But we need to level up a little bit before that. Go back for the really long loud screen now. As always. Oh, there we go. Right, we need to find some fusion cores, don't we? Because I believe I have one. No, I have none. The only one I've got is in there. So let's take it out. Oh, we can leave this torso here as well now. Because we don't need that. Or that. But we do need to get right, let's get all these. Oh, is that all I've got? Left arm, left leg, right arm is better than nothing. Hmm, interesting. I haven't got a chess piece. I thought I had a chess piece. Obviously not. Right. Uh, what have we got active? Oh, bugger. I'm not doing that. Alright, let's head down to... Diamond City. And see if we can get <coughs> a few pieces of armour. and talk to Nick. Hey, you were in the paper, right? You're 200 years old. Looking pretty good for your age, huh? Let's go and just... Actually, we just go and talk to Nick. And then we'll... Dad says not to talk to strangers. And then we'll uh, wait for a bit. Ellie, are you here? Nick? Oh, God. 
It's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday, death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Here. I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but... You deserve a reward. <laughs> Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. There's a lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. What else can you tell me? My husband was... murdered. He was just trying to keep them from taking Sean and they... they just... they just... It's okay. You don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers. But they waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. Anything else you remember? We're looking for my baby, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. A lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the Gunners, and of course there's the Institute. So you think this Institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype, anyway. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? The woman was dressed in, uh, I think it was a kind of hazard suit. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Maybe some kind of improvised armor? A lot of hired guns do that to look tough. The hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about them? One of them came right up to me. Bald head. Scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Who is he? Do you think he has Sean? Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, Scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around ten years old. There's no way that could be Sean. Yeah, big difference between an infant and a ten-year-old, but that doesn't mean we're on the wrong track. He could have a son of his own. In any event, they both vanished a while back. No trace. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out. Uh, where they I went. think the desk security gone. doesn't really go to that part of town. But I see him. You two should still be careful. I always am.
Right. I'm in such a low level for this again. I'm not supposed to talk to people I don't know. I uh, didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance? Bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies. They're all dead. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man. More than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. Oh, I'm not going to be able to pick it. That's one heck of a lock. Something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Don't think I can pick this. Hey, Valentine. No luck? Guess we'll need to find the key. We can't get through that door. See that platform in the distance, near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. Come on, Piper. Where is Piper? Can't see her anywhere. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? I need to talk to someone about Kellogg's old house in the West Stands. Mr. Kellogg's residence? He left town a while ago. We foreclosed on the property and locked it up. If there was something belonging to the man that you have a claim on, you could ask the mayor to hear you out. No guarantees. I'll talk to the mayor then. He set aside time to talk to petitioners all day. Best of luck. No funny business around the mayor. Got it? Ah, yes. I remember you. Our new arrival. I wish I was in your shoes, getting to see our glorious city for the first time. How can I help you? A man named Kellogg used to live in the city. I need to search his house. I see. Well, whatever reasons you have, I take my citizens' privacy very seriously. Even after they've left. I can't allow you to invade someone else's home. That's all there is to it. Please, Mayor McDonough. This man, Kellogg, kidnapped my baby. I need to find him. Oh, of course. I... I will do everything in my power to help you overcome this horrible personal tragedy. I remember Mr. Kellogg. Didn't like him myself. Paranoid. Never talked to anyone. I doubt you'll find him, but I insist you take the key to his old house. It's been abandoned, though. I'm afraid this whole thing might be fruitless. Come on, Piper. Too late. You gonna kamikaze off? Or will you be down here waiting? No, you're down there waiting. I should be able to get some. You rescued Valentine. Good work. Most sense scared the hell out of me, but Nikki. He ain't like those institute psychos. It's getting a little dark. Got 
got the key? I did. I did, I did, I did, I did, I did. Oh, excuse me. Let's take a look around. Kellogg must have left something behind. Is there anything up here? I can't remember. They seem small to you. It's certainly seem better Maybe days, hasn't like it? Kellogg would think big. Well, that's one way to hide a room. Gwyneth Stout beer, forty-four caliber bullets, cigars, San Francisco sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. I wonder if dog meat could pick up the scent. Say, that's not a bad idea. Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. You can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Goodbye, Nick. Hopefully not forever. I want to see you and your kids safe and sound when you get back. Good luck. Anytime you need help, just come knocking. Right. I don't think there's anything else in here. Come on, Piper, stop being lazy. Get off your bottom. Good to be back in Diamond Dog City. Meat. Get the scent, boy. Get Kellogg, boy. Take me to that son of a bitch. <laughs> Yay, level up. Hang on, doggy. I want to find. I want to wait and get some Better real armor. Suit? sell these What do I have? 
left arm, left leg. So I need a right arm and a chest piece. So nine and four. And his right leg as well, isn't it? Oh, I'm going to have to buy it because I've got nothing else. This shotgun shells more than anything, don't I? Wait for a Tudo to open up. Hang on, dog meat. You're that new girl, right? Yeah, I'm the new girl. Well, it's good to have you here. Let's see what you have. Don't forget to stock up on ammo. Now, if only I could afford the big boy. That's what I want. If I take that and sell that, <laughs> right, I'm going to have to sell the missile launcher as well. And what, what was it right leg I need? Yeah. Item four. So we're gonna get the that's well, the same. I've got absolutely no money left. And I can go number one. And I can go number two. And I can go number three. Oh, bugger. <sighs> right. I hear there's a bar in the old theater district that's for Raiders only. A combat zone. I'd stay clear if I was you. I'd love to talk, but I have matters to attend to. I'm gonna die so many times now. Quick look at something. Uh, 
Oh, come on, load up. Right, I'm not gonna do like the short streams Monday and Tuesday anymore. I'll just wait till the evening to do those. Come on. I, mean, I know where I'm going, I know we gotta to get to Fort Hagen, but No. Because it's a trap. Hey, San Francisco Sunlights. Kellogg's preferred brand, all right. I'll need your nose to track Kellogg, boy. Okay, boy. Let's track him. Now we gotta be on the lookout for all the bugs and everything. Now I am gonna drop the difficulty a little bit for for this game. Let's just drop it down to hard. So I really struggled. Um, and the railroad one just. Well, this isn't going to go well. Use the rifle for a bit. Were they trying to pin him down? Or did they just have terrible aim? Torn up by his own turret. Took out the targeting computer with one bullet. This guy's a crack shot. Bloody bandages. Dog meat can track this. Kellogg's still out there. We've got to track him, boy. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Go on, then. Looks like this one thought he'd get away. No such luck. No, there's what eighty one. Right now, I think it's dogs, isn't it? Bought one of them. Right, how does this compare to the one I bought? 
item for mm, not brilliant in comparison any meat left on the Brahmin? No. Yay. And give it a quick save. Hello to everyone who's just joined. Welcome. Hope you enjoy watching me get murdered over and over again. Guess I'm aware of that. What is it? Somebody didn't want to get snuck up on here. A decoy. No. Huh? Clever. That was pressing it. It didn't. Nobody's used this recently. Let's just sleep for an hour to get our Somebody's health back. Somebody spent the night here. Gwyneth Stout. One of his creature comforts. Okay, boy. Let's track him. No, now we've got some ghouls to contend with. Ooh. Where was the other one? There he is. At least this time when I've come to find Kellogg, I haven't had to deal with bloody rust devils either. Because that was bloody annoying last time. This didn't do any good for him, did it? Not sure who started it, but this traitor never stood a chance. Doesn't look like a robbery. Must have just gotten in his way. Bodyguard Attention robots to didn't fare too well. Another one of his stogies. <laughs> no, I can't check that. Doggy! We gotta stick together, pal. At least until we find Kellogg. Leave them alone. 
They're not gonna hurt you. I guess for you too, Piper. Well, while we're here, let's see what's in. Is there anything in the back of here? Oh, just some. You can sell all these. I oh know. I tried my best. Ooh, we got a checkpoint. <gasps> Fusion cores. Have you got a pretty much full suit? Yes. I needed this. Hope you plan on using your robot powers for good. No. I've never noticed that checkpoint before. Never come this far, far like doors. Where, where you going? Oh, gee, dog. I'll need your nose to track Kellogg, boy. Well, now we've got to go this way. Right, can we get back to business now? You say something? No. No, I did not. No, I don't think I've ever noticed that death claw there either. Am I getting all the right legs now? Well, actually, I know why. It's because I spent all my money buying. That sounded like a bottle cap mine.
place, huh? Is he in here, boy? This is it, isn't it? Kellogg's here. All right, Blue. It's you and me. I think Dogmeat's earned some time off. Don't worry, Dogmeat. Just saying hello. Hey, boy. Don't worry, Dogmeat. Just saying hello. Hey. Point the way. Piper. You hungry? These always keep me going. <clears throat> Is everything all right between us, Piper? Well, things aren't bad. <laughs> because believe me, you'd know if they were. But I suppose we could be doing better. That was all I had. Sure. Hum, mom. No, you're right, this is as bad as mine. Alright, let's go into the belly of the beast. Ammo. That's it. Better than nothing. Sensor reading detected. Huh? Secure facility infiltrated. Require destruction of fellow sick. You're gonna die. Hello, welcome to the stream, Brett. No. Can't say that I am. Oh, what are we going here? Some loot. Yes. Hmm. 
Не, 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 не. What do you think that was? What do you think, Piper? No, no, we really didn't. Now where'd they get to? Intruder in Fort Hagen, eliminating hostile. Circle. Pound is just vibrated. Set the sniper rifle. Got it. Yay. Yeah. Get some more ammo. Why is he locked even when he's behind the security gate? Oh, excuse me. Got it. Really? A lot of nifty toys in here. Uh, what does mine do? Thirty-two. No, I'll stick with mine. Mm. Right, come on. But I'm not going it that way. There's a fusion core in here. Oh, I don't think there is, is there? No! Ah! I am getting a fairly decent amount of fusion cells though, so I can't complain at that. Go. 
Right, let's give it a quick save. Let's equip this sniper rifle. Oh, he's in there. This is in surprisingly good shape, considering. But we've got to go to this door. This one. When we leave here. Well, if anyone could figure out a good use for it. Look, you're pissed off. I get it. I do. But whatever you hope to accomplish in here. It's not going to go your way. Blue, we're not alone here. Movement detected. There he is. Bosses multiplying. No, there's no first aid box. Fusion core here. Oh, I can't be bothered with that. There's a bubble head. Here somewhere, I think. There it is. Hell yeah. Oh, that's a good one to have as well. You must be terminated. Yes. Nice. I only have got four. Oh, 
I'll take the glue as well. Because we always need. Always on good behavior. You got guts and determination. That's admirable. But you are in over your head in ways you can't possibly comprehend. Normal for other always on good behavior, aren't you? I try to be. Seems like you're doing better than trying. I appreciate it. Too few folks can be bothered. Of course, in my experience, if you want to do real good, playing nice only gets you so far. I mean, look at Diamond City, a place I've been trying to warn of real danger. But every issue I publish, all I hear is. Oh, Piper, why don't you ever publish anything happy? <laughs> Piper, why can't you write something nice for a change? It's enough to make me want to hang up my hat some days. <clears throat> Sounds like it must be exhausting. Huh, no kidding. But people, they just have to know the truth. Sure, it can be scary, knowing what's really out there. <laughs> a night doesn't go by, I'm not afraid. Some institute drone will decide. Today's the day to pay old Piper and family a visit. But it's worth it. Because I know the truth. That's what protects us. Couldn't agree more. How can you protect you and yours if you don't know what you're facing? Exactly. Most folks, though, they'd prefer a comforting lie. Not me. I've seen firsthand what the truth can do. My sister and I, our dad, well, uh, well, I didn't buy it. He was going to leave the gates open. Mm -hmm. My dad found out and was going to turn me. I tried talking to the mayor, but he the mayor sure wanted to talk at You saved those people. No. Those people saved themselves. Because they knew But hey, I I'm sorry if I've been rambling. I just get fired up sometimes. It's just nice to talk to someone who who actually seems to get it, you know? So <coughs> should we head out? No, no, it's 18, for that. Right, let's do... Another one for Black Widow. Coming to get you, Mr. Kellogg. Oh, you sod. Don't you worry. You. Oh yeah. Uh, in one piece. Uh, is there anything in here? Right, 
Right, okay. just sweet. You made it. I'm just up ahead. My sins are standing down. Let's talk. Right. Save. Let's put that at number six. And there she is. The most resilient woman in the Commonwealth. You came a long way. Let's hear it. End of the line, Kellogg. You die, and I get my son back. You can turn around right now. Go back the way you came, Sean. Well, besides being a bit older than you were expecting, I'm afraid he's not even here. So you see, it is the end of the line. Not the way you imagined. Fuck you, Kellogg. Let him go. Your time's done. Your son is exactly where he belongs. He's home. In the Institute. Here, the Institute? I'll find my son no matter where he is. <laughs> That's the spirit. You know, you surprise me, I have to admit. I find myself actually kind of liking you. You might have actually been a good mother. And I admire your dedication. Even if it is ultimately useless. But I think we've been talking long enough. We both know how this has to end. So. You ready? In a hundred years, when I finally die, I only hope I go to hell so I can kill you all over again. You piece of shit. Ah, cat. <laughs> Come on, then, Mr. Kellogg. Crap, I'm nearly dead. Keep you Kellogg's outfit. I'm right past eleven, right? There it is. <laughs> All right, let's go and watch the print win.
Bueno, aquí está. Bueno. Ah, uh, shift. I got access to the logs and everything, you know. Sorry, Pipe, you took too long. to do it at night as well. by folks out here. I guess I need to know you do too. Oh, nothing. All right. Right, so let's oop, one thing. Before I do, I'm going to head back to... This is Paladin Dance on frequency 9-5. Shut up now. I'm going to head back to... Sanctuary. Repair my armor. <laughs> oh! And I'm gonna put a uh, piper in this one. So I'm gonna have this one, put piper in the other one. One heck of a gap, Science perk. I'm going to leave the fat man. Uh, 
Right, I'm going to cook up all of this meat. into something nice First, Heads up. Shoot. Can do. Piper forgot to you can get in there. Heads up. What you got for me? Right, we are going to so go back to Nick. We're going to carry on doing this uh, Lost Patrol. And hopefully, we can do it this time. Oh. And not have to run off like a big girl, big girl blows. No, there is some power armor on top of. Do I leave a sniper rifle? Oh, bugger. There it is. Now, there's some power armor up there. I know.
Oh crap, I made it. I'm <laughs> That's not going to be any good. Real bad move. Come on, go, Taylor. The Verti Bird fall. My legs are going to break soon. Oh, it's just an actual frame. <laughs> oh, I'm such a child. Right, uh, it's this one, isn't it? to the holiday Before I head back to
let's head here. Head on up. Uh, is this a gunner's camp up here? Here's a crashed airplane. I thought there was something down there. Ooh. What does that do? 64 minders. 47. Keep going towards this bunker. Right, let's just discover the Galleria. That I want to keep Piper with me. <laughs> because once we've got her affinity up to maximum. Um you get double experience for I know it's locations discovered and there's another one as well I can't remember what that one is you ready boy Around here, but then again, it's ran by water, of course, there are. Oh. 
Paladin Brandis? Freeze. One more step and I'll... I'll blow your damn head off. Who are you? Who sent you? How did you get in here? Easy, Paladin. I'm with the Brotherhood. The Brotherhood? No, 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 it can't be. They're, they're, they're too far away. They wouldn't send you, would they? Let's, uh, let's say I believe you. How did you find me? I followed the distress beacons left by your team. Their holotapes led me here. The others? What, uh, what happened to them? They're dead, Paladin. I recovered their tags. You... you... you did? Thank you. This... this really means a lot to me. I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but... But I'd hoped you've been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, odds and ends. If, if you see anything you want, take it, take it. The Brotherhood needs you, Paladin. It's time you reported in. I, I... I can't. It's... it's been too long. I... I wouldn't be of any use. No one knows the Commonwealth better than you. We need your help. I've been here too long. I'm... I'm... I'm not myself. Would they still take me? The Brotherhood will honor the memory of your team. Shouldn't you be the one to tell their story? Unless I go back, their... their sacrifices... Everything we went through, it'll be forgotten. I can't let that happen. I'll do it. For them. All right, I'll, uh, I'll get my things together. Thank you. Thank you for everything. Oh, it's awesome to say. Right, let's head back to the police station. Because we've got to go back there anyway now. Check something. Look at these burn marks. These were here. You must have spent a whole case of ammo holding this site. Suppose that means we missed all the fun. I prefer laser weapons myself. It's Excuse a cleaner me, shot. Paladin Dance. It leaves that memorable Cavalry's ozone right. smell behind. And it looks like they sent in the big guns. That ship. I've never seen anything like it. Amazing, isn't it? We call our ship the Pridwin. She's loaded with enough troops and supplies to mount a major offensive. If she's here, Elder Maxon's here. And that means we're going to war. Gonna be a quick war with that thing on our side. You two can't be that naive. That thing, it's just gonna escalate everything. You can't honestly believe it will stem the bloodshed. That's the plan. If history's proven anything, it's that an overwhelming show of force has a chance of halting a conflict before it begins. That being said, you're about to get to know the Pridwin up close and personal. I've received orders that we're both to report to her immediately. Follow me up to the roof of the police station. We're going for a little ride. 
Paladin dance. What are you waiting for? Get up to the Pridwin now. No, I have to tell you. Just the person to me. I wanted to see. I've got more locations on potential artifacts if you're in. No, not right now, Hayden. When I get off duty, that Salisbury steak is mine. Let me out. Do I hear a helicopter outside? Oh dear. I'm not sure if you can, you can hear that, but it was quite loud. You'll be doing a lot more than that later. We're on final approach to the airport. The Pridwin should be coming into view just ahead. We'll be meeting Lancer Captain Kells on the flight deck. Just stick close to me and answer all of his questions. I am tired. Here's the big beast. It was funny doing this flight with um, Tinker Tom flying because he was all over the place. Answer Captain Kells. Follow me. Look alive. Hmm? 
Piper. You know that you could use a pick me up. That's all. Sure. Permission to come aboard, sir? Permission granted. Welcome back, Paladin. Allow me to be the first to congratulate you on a successful mission. And is this our new recruit? Yes, sir. I feel promoted her to initiate, and I'd like to sponsor her entry into our rankings personally. Yes, we've read your reports. You'll be pleased to know that Elder Maxon's approved your request. Place the recruit in your charge. Thank you, sir. And my current orders? You are to remain on the Pridlet and await further instructions. Very good, sir. Ad Victorium, Captain. Ad Victorium, Paladin. Captain Kells? So, you're the one Paladin Dance has taken under his wing. <laughs> you don't look much like a soldier. Mm -hmm. Looks can be deceiving. Which is precisely why I personally insist on scrutinizing every recruit who boards this vessel. I've read Paladin Dance's reports. He seems to think you'll make a fine addition to the Brotherhood. You might expect an endorsement like that to grant you a great deal of latitude with us. But let me make one thing clear. The Brotherhood of Steel has traveled to the Commonwealth with a specific goal in mind. As the captain of this vessel, I won't allow anyone to jeopardize our mission, no matter how valuable they think they are. Understood? Absolutely. Good. That's all for now, soldier. Your orders are to proceed to the command deck for the address. After which, Elder Maxon wishes to have a word with you. If you have any questions, ask me now. Otherwise, you're dismissed. I don't have any questions. Then I suggest you head over to the command deck immediately. Dismissed, Initiate. Welcome aboard. Elder I know, I know, I know. Brothers and sisters, the road behind has been long and fraught with difficulty. Each and every one of you has surpassed my expectations by rapidly facilitating our arrival in the Commonwealth. You have accomplished this amazing feat without a hint of purpose or direction. And most impressively, without question. Now that the ship is in position, it is time to reveal our purpose and our beneath the Commonwealth. There is a cancer, known as the Institute. A malignant growth that needs to be cut before it infects the surface. They are experimenting with dangerous technologies that could prove to be the world's undoing for the second time in recent history. The Institute scientists have created a weapon that transcends the destructive nature of the atom bomb. They call their creation the Synth. A robotic abomination of technology that is free-thinking and masquerades as a human being. This notion that a machine could be granted free will is not only offensive, but horribly dangerous. And like the atom, if it isn't harnessed properly, it has the potential of rendering us extinct as a species. I am not prepared to allow the Institute to continue this line of experimentation. Therefore, the Institute and their sins are considered enemies of the Brotherhood of Steel and should be dealt with swiftly and mercilessly. This campaign will be costly, and many lives will be lost. But in the end, we will be saving humankind from its worst enemy, itself. Ad Victorium! Ad Victorium! Ad Victorium! If you run into any sense, Sir, Shoot to kill. I care about them, you don't know. take prisoners. The people of the Commonwealth. I can see that. They're playing with fire, and we need to save them. Exactly. I just hope we're here in time. I refuse to allow the mistakes of the past to be repeated. What do you want from me? I want you to start taking responsibility for this planet. To start making a difference. And from what I've read in Paladin Dance's reports, You've already begun that journey. Seeing as he's one of my most respected field officers, you couldn't get a better recommendation. Therefore, from this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of knight. And, befitting your title, we're granting you a suit of power armor to protect you on the field of battle. 
Wear it with pride. I'll do my best to live up to it. I'm certain that you will. In any event, once you're finished becoming familiar with the Pridwin and my staff, report to the flight deck for your new orders. Welcome aboard the Pridwin, soldier. Make us proud. Superstructure integrity green. Hull plating. Yay, they've been making upgrade to T60 power armor now. And I think this chess piece will be interchangeable. I have to wait and see. That is report. Green across the board, sir. Nothing new. Good. Carry on, Knight. Alright, I'm gonna take my Helmet off. So how did it look out there? We had a lot of work there ahead of are. us, brother. How did it go with Elder Maxon? Maxon seems so young compared to everyone else. You're okay with that? Don't let his age fool you. Maxon's a brilliant tactician, a formidable warrior, and possesses an idealistic vision for the future of the Brotherhood. I'd follow him anywhere, without question. I was very impressed with him. He seems to know what's best for everyone. Exactly. Without his determination, we'd be lost. I just hope you appreciate how much of a chance I'm taking bringing you into the fold this quickly. Not to put too fine a point on it, but if you screw up, we go down together. I won't let you down, Dance. I promise. Good. Now, I know you're eager to hop into a suit of power armor and take the fight to the Institute. But first things first. In order to be an effective part of the team, you need to learn your way around this ship and get to know its crew. Since I've been officially assigned to you as your sponsor, I'd recommend taking me along with you. Sounds good. Let's go. Outstanding. Look alive. What do you want? Paladin dance. What do you want? Just wanted to check in, see how you feel things are going between us. I don't see how this is a relevant question right now. That's all for now. Not a problem. Right, have we finished that other mission then? No, not yet. Right, let's finish this. Our first. Ah, oh, good. You're finally here. Just set the books down anywhere. I'll get to them as soon as I can. I think you're confusing me with someone else. Hmm. Perhaps I need to rummage through the supply bins for a new pair of glasses. Since it's obvious that you aren't who I was expecting, would you mind telling me why you're here? Maxon wanted me to meet the crew. You were next on my list. Ah, yes. You must be the new recruit described in Paladin Dance's report. Mm -hmm. Under normal circumstances, I'd provide you with a proper orientation of my department. However, I'm woefully behind setting up research patrols and getting bombarded with requests for technical documentation. Unfortunately, I'm lacking the personnel needed to get the job done. Maybe I could lend a hand. That would be splendid. As you patrol the Commonwealth, keep your eyes open for blueprints, memos, manuals, books, charts. Anything containing useful technical data. I'm authorized to pay you for each bundle of documents that you recover. And if you wish to be assigned to a research patrol, I have plenty of them waiting to be filled. In any event, it was a pleasure to meet you, Knight. <laughs> Glad you finally stopped by, soldier. Are you ready for your medical exam? Sure, go right ahead. All right. I'm going to ask you a series of medical-related questions, and I'd like you to answer me to the best of your ability. First question. As a child, were you ever exposed to radiation for an extended period of time? There wasn't that much radiation around before the bombs fell. Before the bombs? What? Let, let me check my notes. You were a vault dweller? 
You're probably healthier than anyone else aboard. Anyway, sorry I missed that in your records. Just going down the list of questions. I'm sure you understand. Okay, second question. Have you ever had or come in contact with a person confirmed to be carrying a communicable disease? Have you had problems with the crew catching diseases? Well, yes, actually. It's not unusual for our recon teams to stumble across contaminated environments or disease-carrying creatures. We don't want a single crewman infecting the entire ship. Anyway, uh, this exam is about you, so... Have you had or come in contact with anyone carrying a communicable disease? Never been seriously sick in my life. Good, good. Third question. And please, answer honestly. Have you ever had sexual relations with any species considered non-human? Those species aren't my type. Good. I find the practice highly distasteful myself. Last question. Would you have any problems pulling the trigger on an enemy of the Brotherhood, whether they're human, formerly human, or machine? Nope. No problem whatsoever. Excellent. You'll fit in quite well around here. Excellent. I think I've got all the information I need. I see no reason to prevent you from beginning your duties immediately. If you ever need medical assistance, you let me know. There. Try it now. Nothing. I was supposed to report ten minutes ago. So, you're the new recruit I heard about. You're the one who decided uh, not what I was expecting. <laughs> Sounds like you're disappointed. I'm not disappointed, just surprised. You don't look like one of the usual wastelanders we pick up. Anyway, since you came down here to meet me, we may as well get it over with. My name's Ingram, and this lovely little grease pit is where you'll usually find me. If your power armor's too tight in the crotch, the prid one's about to crash into the ground, or a robot's gone haywire, you come see me. Sounds like you have a pretty full plate. Plate? Hell, I have a whole table's worth of duties around here. There isn't a day that goes by on this tub without five or six oh. things breaking down. And since I'm stuck in this rig, I'm not quite as spry as I used to be. The work tends to pile up. Actually, you seem to be getting around really well. I suppose it's better than the alternative. Anyway, I'm sure you're here to get your hands on some power armor. There's a pretty decent T-60 suit sitting in Bay 3 that's all yours. The left leg actuator's a bit sticky, but it'll keep the creeps off of you. Oh, and if you need any work done on it, feel free to use the workshops around here. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to get back to work. Congratulations on the promotion night. Uh, Bay 3. By Elder Maxon's orders, all forms of technology should be confiscated or collected. Uh, I'm gonna get in that now. Nothing to report right now, Knight. Lancer Captain Kells is one of the finest officers I've ever had the pleasure of serving under. <laughs> now that's what I call locked and loaded. I do want to change the. Nine three oh two two three two I just need to uh, 
change it to the Brotherhood of Steel colours, which I should be able to do now. Step forward, Knight. Even though they've locked me in this blasted cage, I promise that I won't bite. Looks uncomfortable in there. It's not that bad. And this is the stowage depot. And I, as you probably already guessed, am the ship's quartermaster. I Dr. don't Tito. like the Brotherhood. Powers that be have me locked in here, so I can keep an eye on the Brotherhood's valuables. If you need to stock up on supplies before you head out on a mission, this is the place to buy them. That's good to know. I'm glad you're the agreeable type. When I tell most of the new recruits that they have to buy their own equipment, they give me the stink eye. The good news is by having a constant flow of caps, I'm able to buy whatever you bring me. Yeah, I'm mostly interested in weapons, but I'll take anything useful. Of course, if you're just looking to make a few caps on the side, huh? Doesn't sound... Well, it is. It just didn't... Mm -hmm. And since I'm stuck up here, uh -huh. after you're done with the meat, in the meantime... For two and a half, they'll stay dead. Advice to live by. Alright, what else we gotta do for this? Oh, it's done. Yeah, we've leveled up again. Actually, I could do with that. So the fusion cores last Damn longer. Damn ferals. Radiation is a twisted sense of humor. Right, this is what this one involves. I was just going to Fort Strong. I think it is. yourself with the Prigman's crew. Are you ready for your next assignment, sister? Yes, Elder. Good. Let's get right to it, then. Shall we? Take a look over there. That's Fort Strong. And it's infested with super mutants. Having those aberrations of nature close enough to smell is making me sick to my stomach. To make matters worse, they're sitting on top of a massive stockpile of fat man shells we could use in our campaign. I want you to head over there. Wipe out everything that moves, and secure that stockpile. Understood? Consider it done. Look, I realize you're eager to take the fight to the Institute, but it'll have to wait. The Brotherhood cannot allow those abominations to have a nuclear arsenal at their fingertips. It'll be a pleasure to exterminate that mutant filth. Now, we have a vertebrate on standby, fully armed and ready to depart. Use it to carry our message to Fort Strong and wipe those dirty mutants from the face of the earth. Dismissed. Come on, Downs. Yeah, this one. Oh, it's the only one here.
I'm not flying it, am I? That's not going to go well. Brotherhood within striking bastards of the city. Yeah, research. Carry food with you. You'll end up eating some pretty questionable things to stay alive. Vanguard. Now that we have take all this stuff. This is our supply. Unless we're here. <clears throat> welcome, welcome, welcome. Is it summertime in Australia? I think it is, isn't it? Well, it's cold and chilly over here in the UK. See if we can get any of these from the chopper. Dan's one, you on target acquired. I'll try and keep him in your sights. Careful, there could be more of those around. Oh, my aim is terrible. Primary target down. Look at that thing, bleed. I'm going to find a place to set her down and then hightail it back to the Fredwin for repairs. I should also congratulate you on the Ashes win as well. As much as it pains me to uh, say that. Because he's going to have some good stuff on him. <laughs> now I didn't say that. I did not say anything about that. I was just congratulating you on your victory. <laughs> something significant in this area to merit these fortifications. Well, you've also just had your first uh, Australian win the 
Australian Open for the uh, first time is it forty odd years, something like that. I do I do know my sports a little bit, so. I, mean, oh, I can always talk about that too. This area seems to be in disarray. I wonder if this is recent. down to the armory. Is there anything else in here? at the moment. So with with the time difference and everything. Um I don't know if it's eleven hours, twelve hours difference between there and the UK. I can never remember. I know Nadal's in the final. And if he wins, he'll be the most successful. I said Nadal will be the most successful. Um, uh, what's that? Uh, out there. So Can't think of the word. Most successful men's player in terms of tournament victories. Mm. Got rid of him with the Report back to dance, is that it? Where's he gone? Why don't you walk away and leave me? Look at this place. You must hate these mutants as much as I do. Well, eh. Why do you hate super mutants so much? They're responsible for the death of a close friend, a brotherhood knight named Cutler. So when you ask if I hate them, I say hate's too gentle a word. These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward, only to wind up stumbling two steps back. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the synths. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. 
Can you imagine what the synths would do to us if they ever got the upper hand? It would be Armageddon repeated. And maybe the end of everything that we hold dear. <sighs> Look, I don't mean to bore you with my rhetoric. I just want you to understand how important these missions are. Don't apologize. It reminds me why I'm doing this. Thank you, sister. It's good to know you're taking my advice to heart. Anyway, that's enough of that. What's important here is that you got the job done and secured these warheads. You should head back up to the Pridwin and talk to Maxon. I'm sure he'll want to debrief you as soon as possible. Dismissed. Ah. But thank you for sticking around to watch the stream as well for a bit. It means a lot. Especially to a small creator like myself. No loot tube. No, I didn't. Right, will I just be able to fast travel up to the Pridwin? Should be able to, as long as there's no enemies around. Shut up. Outstanding work at Fort Strong, soldier. It was an honor fighting for the Brotherhood. I'm glad you feel that way, because our mission here has only just begun. In order to bring the Institute to its knees, we need to use every weapon at our disposal. I try to supply my soldiers with the best. That's why I'm giving you these. Signal grenades can call a vertebrate to your location when you need aerial transport. Simply throw one to the ground, and the vertebrate will hone in on the unique electromagnetic smoke it needs. <clears throat> Once you're aboard, use the map on your pit boy to interface with the pilot's navigation system, so he'll be able to take you wherever you need. Thank you, Elder. I'll make good use of them. I expect that you will. Now, I'm sure you're aware that Fort Strong was simply the first step towards the liberation of the Commonwealth. An even greater task lies ahead. By now, I'm sure you've deduced that our arrival in the Commonwealth wasn't coincidental. We're here because of a unique energy reading recorded by Paladin Dance's recon team. According to our scribes, the reading indicated a level of technology that only the Institute could achieve. The moment this information came to light, our mission became clear. The Institute, and everyone responsible for the creation of the Synths, must be eliminated, at all costs. To accomplish this goal, we need to locate the Institute's headquarters. I've had our scribes meticulously searching the Commonwealth, but they've come up empty-handed. Anything you need, Elder. You just say the word. I want you to get out there, and become our eyes and ears on the ground. You seem to have a vested interest in locating the Institute before we met. So I'm confident you'll travel in the right circles. If you discover a way in, I need you to report it to me immediately. Any questions, Knight? Aren't there any pre-war records about the Institute that might help us? Our records indicate that the Institute was born from the remnants of a pre-war educational facility. The Commonwealth Institute of Technology. The ruins of the facility are at the center of the city, but we've already searched them thoroughly. The location appears to have been abandoned long ago. So it appears that the trail ends there. Anything else, Knight? Not right now, Elder. Very well, then. Dismissed. Right, what? Well.
Oh, that's what we need to do, isn't it? Oh, oh we're gonna be outside. Makes sense. Oh, excuse me. So I'm trying to read my other monitor. No. These load screens. And now, uh, a word or several from our sponsors. John and Kevin. You see that big blimp? What's the Brotherhood of Steel? Well, why are they here? Talk with Nikki. Come on, Nikki. I'm just asking for your opinion. It'd be a great quote. She's my client, Piper. Why don't you learn not to snoop on a woman's private affairs? Well, well. Speak she of the devil. You're back. And not with your son. What happened? You were right, Nick. Kellogg took my baby. Who's, that um... wasn't all. A doll playing. Surprise, you've been took to five sets. He gave them Sean. The Institute? Oh boy. I'm sorry, friend. Truly. That makes things considerably more complicated. He ain't kidding. Heck, Nick's a synth, and even he doesn't know how to get in. No synth does. Security protocols strip those memories out. I need to find a way. I've been investigating these creeps for over a year now. <laughs> the Commonwealth's boogeyman. Feared and hated by everyone. True enough. Sometimes they snatch people in the middle of the night, and sometimes they leave old synths behind to remind us that they're out there. But to this day, there's one thing nobody really knows. Where the Institute actually is. Or how to get in. Exactly. But there's one person who has to know, right? The guy who just handed them Sean. Kellogg. Huh. Man like that would have had access. In and out. Yeah, but I'm guessing he wasn't the surrender and talk type, was he? He's dead, Nick. So, a murderer and a kidnapper gets his brains blown out by... He wasn't gonna talk. Even if I had a way of bringing him alive. Gets his brains blown out. Huh. You're talking crazy here, Nick. Look, there's a place in good name. If anyone could get it. I hope you're right, Nick. Let's see. I guess we're gonna need a piece of kelp. Jesus, Nick! I know it's grisly. Actually? Cybernetics, huh? Whether we're riding this cre- I have to go to the memory den either way, if I'm gonna introduce you to Omari. But if you want- It's you and me, Nick. Let's get going. Don't worry. We're gonna get your boy back. Just a few more steps. Uh, well, you two are out. I'm gonna do some more research. I'll be at the public if you need me. Alright, let's get ourselves another perk. And we'll put it in armor. Medvedev. As I say, I'm surprised he's been took to... Five sets. But then again, the doll is getting on a bit now, isn't he? Is he clay? Is he clay or a hard? Do crazy things when they're scared. Court. Diamond City's motto. When Alex France is clay, and he's really good on clay. Right, 
right, let's head to Park Street. These load screens, so irritating. That's the point, I need to go back to Sanctuary at some point to cook up all the meat I've collected. Right, good neighbor is just down here. A lot of my cases dead end in Boston Common. What's that? Yes, we're not. I don't. Look who it is. It was. But when you just finish your missions and whatnot, it, it just goes up so quick. Where did you? Oh! Now can I get through this way? No! Yes! No, maybe not. Take the nuclear material. Who's out there? Not wanted here. Nothing there now. What do you think? I don't know. Jump in the shadows. Yeah, yeah. Probably right. Hard. I couldn't I couldn't remember if it was hard or clay. I've got myself lost. That's the back of the hall. And if we keep going. Shouldn't have attracted the attention of the gunners. No, I can't get up there. Oh, there we go. Hopefully, now I missed. Oh, 
fuck it, I wasn't paying attention to my house. Right. Let's concentrate, focus. Even good people do crazy. Th oh, bugger. Let's head back over there. It's all over. Load screens. <laughs> so irritating. I'm trying to read what the sevens on the signs. Now I'm stuck. A lot of my cases dead end in Boston Common. I prefer not to join them. Alright, let's leave them. There it is. It all went the wrong way round. Let's talk to Finn and watch him get murdered by Mr. Hancock. Checking down another wayward husband to his mistress? Why? Someone stand you up? You trying that, uh, what do you call it? Evasive language mm. on me? And who are you, huh? Valentine's new dick in training? We're hiring, but I don't think you'd measure up. Don't be like that. You just got the look of someone who's in the market for a little insurance. Unless it's keep dumb assholes away from me insurance, I'm not interested. Now don't be like that. I think you're gonna like what I have on offer. You hand over everything you got in their pockets, or accidents start happening to you. Big, <laughs> bloody accidents. Whoa, whoa, time out. Nick Valentine makes a rare visit to town, and you're hassling his friend here with that extortion crap? Good to see you again, Nick. Hancock? What do you care? She ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn. Go. <laughs> Sounds like Ellie account. needs to talk to you us. Keep letting outsiders we walk should head back to the office. One Next chance we get. A new man. Come on, man. This is me we're talking It's the first about. time I brought Nick here, so it's, it's the first time I've heard that conversation. <laughs> Why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. You all right, sister? I'm fine. Thanks for taking care of him. Good. Now don't let this incident take your view of our little community. Good neighbors of the people, for the people. You feel me? Everyone's welcome. Yeah, I feel you. Good. You stay cool, and you'll be part of the neighborhood. So long as you remember who's in charge. Suppose someone should make use of it. Right.
that depends on that depends sometimes. I mean, I don't know if you can tell, but I've got the, like the fast load mod well, well. enabled, I thought you had forgotten. and uh, it just Dr. takes Amari. forever. Still, I take it this isn't a social call. Doctor, it's time for you to reverse death itself. What? Uh, I wouldn't have put it quite that way, but it's true. We need a dead man's memories. A guy named Kellogg. Are you too mad? Putting aside the fact that you're asking me to defile a corpse, <laughs> you don't realize that the memory simulators require intact, living brains to function. Please. Nick told me you're the only one who can make this work. This dead brain had inside knowledge of the Institute, Amari. The biggest scientific secret of the Commonwealth. You need this, and so do we. Fine. I'll take a look. But no guarantees. Do you have it with you? Here's what I could find. What's this? This isn't a brain. This is... Wait. That's the hippocampus. And this thing attached to it? A neural interface? Ah, those circuits look awfully familiar. I'm not surprised. From what I've seen, all Institute technology has a similar architecture. Go on, Doctor. Mr. Valentine is an older generation synth. But Institute technology Ooh. being what it is, the brain implant could fit him. But that's an incredible risk to take. We're talking about wiring something to his brain. Don't worry about me, Amari. I'm well past the warranty date anyway. <laughs> hey, I appreciate this, Nick. You can thank me when we've found your son. All right, let's do this. Whenever you're ready, Mr. Valentine, just sit down. If I start cackling like an old grizzled mercenary, pull me out, okay? Let's see here. I need you to keep talking to me, Mr. Valentine. Any slight change in your cognitive functions could be dire. Are you feeling any different? There's a lot of flashes. Static. I, I, I can't make sense of any of it, Doc. That's what I was afraid of. The mnemonic impressions are encoded. It appears the Institute has one last failsafe. There's a lock on the memories in the implant. Tell me you have a way past this, Doctor. Let me think. The encryption we load both. He'll act as a host. Sure. All right. Let's get started. Just sit down over there. See you on the other side. All right, we're just gonna run through all this. And so when I do my next playthrough, I'm gonna go through everything in little details and whatnot. Initiating brainwave migration between the transplant and the host. Mnemonic activity coming from the transplant. It's degenerated, but it's there. We're going to load you into the strongest memories we can find. They might not be stable. Just hold on. Oh, it's so bright. Far too bright. Can you hear me? Ah, oh, good. The simulation appears to be working, although the memories are quite fragmentary. I'll try to step you through the intact memories and hope we find one that gives us some clue to the Institute's location. There. This is the earliest intact memory I can find. Yep. Oh, there we go. This doesn't seem to be what we're looking for. There appears to be another intact memory close to you in temporal sequence. There. So I was gonna Let's keep looking. 
I'll connect you to the next intact memory. How did you think this was going to end, Kellogg? I found another memory to try. I'll connect you. Ah. Uh, so someone told me about this when I did the railroad playthrough. You can aside from the last one, you can just walk through all these. Well, we seem to be getting closer. Try this next one. Mr. Kellogg, I'm glad you decided to oh. keep getting warmer. One of these has got to tell us something. We're running out of brain here. Ah, oh. oh, there's one that looks mostly intact. Connecting now. Cryogenic stasis. Suspended. I found another intact memory. Whenever you're ready. Yeah, this is the one you can't skip. Is that your son? This appears to be a very recent memory. So, good news, I think. Oh boy. Piper has really done it this time. I mean, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying she's right, but. Mayor. Let's stand in the corner so we can see everything. I probably shouldn't have used the Kellogg. It's okay. One of these days, you're gonna get your head blown off just barging in here like that. Minimizing my exposure to civilians is a priority. Forget I said anything. So what's the big crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the Institute. Left? As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgil. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. Wow. Some heads are gonna roll for this. Capture and return, or just elimination? Elimination. He was working on a highly classified program. No kidding. One of the top bioscience boys? Damn. So, I guess you're taking the kid back with you. Affirmative. Your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil. You're taking me home to my father? Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. Okay. <laughs> X688. Ready to relay with Sean. Bye, Mr. Kellogg. I hope I see you again soon. Bye. Teleportation. Now it all makes sense. Nobody's found the entrance to the There is an because entrance. There is no entrance. Let me pull you out of there as soon as you're ready. <laughs> there is an entrance, and I think you, the only way you find only um, faction you find it with is the Minuteman. Okay, I don't know what kind of side effects the procedure might have had. No one's ever done this before. How do you feel? I'm okay, Doctor. Thank you. That's good, but I want you to keep monitoring yourself. We have to be sure there's no long-term damage. Are you ready to talk about what happened in there? We got what we needed. The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. Yes, their greatest secret has finally been revealed. But that only leads to more questions. How does it work? Where do we go next? That scientist Kellogg was supposed to track down. Virgil. We need to find him. You're right. A rogue Institute scientist could answer all kinds of questions. Where did the memory say he was? The glowing sea? That doesn't make sense. No one goes there. Not even if they were desperate. If we need to find Virgil, then I'm going after him. If you're going to go, be prepared. 
You'll need some way to combat the radiation there. It's called the Glowing Sea for a reason. I'll find a way to get through the rats. Don't worry. Good luck, and be safe. By the way, I unplugged Mr. Valentine first. Removed the implant while you were waking up. He's waiting for you upstairs. All right, I'm gonna take... about nothing never mind if you say so anyway I feel fine so let's get going let's get going Nick been one heck of a ride so far let's see where it takes us next <laughs> right He is all the way down here somewhere. So if we travel to Fort... Actually, I'm going to go back to Sanctuary first. Then we'll travel to Fort Hagen. And make our way south from there. It's going to be a long old walk. No, I'm not interested in that Hancock. <laughs> oh. oh, excuse me. Job. I'll leave the fat man behind now. Picked up some more meat, so Just leave all these behind as well. Oh, oh crap! Oh well. But those defenses. I've got nothing else I need right now. I think Preston may want to chat though. I'm not interested in talking to Preston. Oh, I haven't got armor. Can I put the Brotherhood? No. Let's put that on it. Uh. Hey, do you have a moment? I wanted to thank you for helping us out in Concord. If only we'd run into you sooner. I 
much. Okay. Ah. Uh. Oh, the cooking station's down by. I didn't move it, did I? Balls. as well because it'll get rid of the radiation we'll get from it I love having them because they, because, because they get rid of radiation as well. Not going to use that because I'm not using any melee weapons. Right, I'm going to pull, well I'll get down to Fort Hagen. And then I'm going to pause it, I'm going to go and make myself a cup of coffee. that I could do with a nice warm drink because it's not very really warm in here at the moment <sighs> let's wait for it to load so we've got a long long walk south now right I will be back in a minute
Oh, all right, I'm back, and um, unfortunately, I didn't see your message, so I'm afraid I didn't make you one. My apologies. Uh, I'm sure you understand. Hello, welcome to the stream. Uh, the person above you who commented uh, wanted me to make them a cup of coffee while I made one. But I didn't see their message, so... Uh, T60. Try and get some experience. The chess piece isn't T60 though, that's the one you get from the Cambridge Polymer Labs. It's slightly better. That's T45. Shooting. No, oh, is that unique? Ah, uh, trying to be childish again. I am such a child. Oh, there's your ghouls in it, this one. Oh, I missed. Look who it is. My aim's terrible with a sniper rifle. I'm getting sidetracked. I've got a long walk ahead. There you go, Nick. I think there's raiders here, aren't there?
No, we only got eight rounds left. No, I'm gonna die, gonna die, gonna die. Are you gonna get the weapon out or no? Yes. I've done a Minutemen playthrough, Railroad playthrough, and an Institute one. No, oh, no. I'm, I'm not good enough for survival. Shooting straight, rookie. Because I'm trying, I'm just trying to get through this one quick. I'm just doing this one on hard, I think it is. No, wrong one. Pretty much what I've got now. Right, there was ammo. Right, let's carry on down to the glowing sea. So the, the second playthrough I did, which was the Minuteman, I did, oh crap, oh, I very, is that a death claw? I very rarely used past trouble in that playthrough. Come on, Nick. All right, let's eat some of this food we uh, cooked up. We've got a long old walk. Power armor, yeah. Hmm. 
was T51 as well. So, as I was saying, the Minuteman playthrough I did. I think it was like level 60 or so, 50 or 60 before I even come down here to the glowing sea to see Virgil. I've done Far Harbour. And Nuka World before I'd even set foot down here. Snuck up behind me then. Oh, it's a brotherhood. Right, let's keep going south. Oh. I should have stocked up on ammo. So the, the one shotgun I found in that Minute Man playthrough was the best gun I've ever found. But I don't think I'm going to find anything like that ever again. Give me my handgun, there we go. I hate you. Blowflies aren't too bad, but sting wings. Well, such a pain in the ass. Mole rats in there. Give me the weapon I have selected. Right, let's just leave him be. Oh, 
as I'm not going to do any exploring round here. I just want to get down to Virgil, talk to him, get the plans, and head back to the Pridwin to get them sorted. Don't you get away from me. Well, that's not a bad weapon, I suppose. Right, I'm getting sidetracked. Come on, Nick. Oh, that always puts a smile on my face. I don't know, to be honest. Uh A lot of them are useful. But I don't know. Depends on what kind of playthrough you want to do, really, doesn't it? And obviously, if you're on stealth, you got stuff to help you with that. Like a, a sniper roy, sniper play through stealth. There's loads of different perks to aid you. And Stop right there, stranger. You approach Atom's holy ground. Why? State your purpose or be divided in his sight. I'm here because I need your help. Do you seek division? Have you come to merge with Atom? To be split in his infinite glory. Or I've never used that to be honest. Down his followers. I'm looking for someone named Virgil. Virgil? Yes, we know this Virgil. Mm -hmm. I need to speak with you. What do you need of me, child? I'm looking for someone named Virgil. Have you seen him? Yes, I know of him. What do you want with him? I just need some information from him. He has sought refuge with Atom. I would know more before I tell you where he is. What do you want with him? I need his help reaching the Institute. I have heard of this Institute. They hide themselves, trying to avoid the power of Atom. A futile effort. In truth, this Virgil has caused some concern. Some believe his presence is an affront to Atom. Though he came to trade with us on a few occasions, we have had little other contact with him. It was quite clear he wanted to be left alone. 
You can find him southwest. So I do like getting I would approach the gun nut and the science ones up there. I feel he does not want visitors. Oh, there's is it in yours? Yes. Right, let's make our way up through here if we'll fit. Yep. No, not going that way. I wonder if the death claw is going to be here this time. The one I did find amusing though is... Oh, what's, what's it called? Big leagues, because that combined with the 2076 World Series bat, that can produce some funny results. I'm gonna say with, with the next one I do, because the first time I played the game was with like the institute and because it was first time playing I didn't really focus on a lot the little details and whatnot so when I do the next one I'm it's going to be the institute again but I'm going to try and focus a lot more on different things I'm getting ranking up and everything Not good, not good, not gonna go well. Well, we've still got some... Oh, crap. Well, you missed both of them. We'll be taking that. Thank you, Nick. And I've never really used anything on the look or agility side to be honest I've, I've never gone down that that route I did try it but I just couldn't do it hold it take it nice and slow no sudden moves. I know you're from the Institute. <coughs> so where's Kellogg? Huh? Trying to sneak up on me while you distract me? It's not going to work. I'm not stupid. I knew they'd send him after me. Take it easy. Kellogg's dead. Dead? He's dead. Don't you lie to me. I'm not lying. I killed him myself. Did you? Kellogg was ruthless. There's a reason uh -huh. I knew they'd send him after me. And so you, you, then what do you want with me? I know you were part of it. And you escaped. They sent Kellogg to kill you. How the hell do you know any of that? No, it doesn't matter. 
I'm not going back. <laughs> I can't go back. Look at me. Why are you even here? What do you want? Yeah, Kellogg's dead. Relax. I just need to know how to get in there. Wait, what? Are you serious? You want to get into the Institute? Are you insane? Never mind how nearly imp What reason? I'm trying to find my son. The Institute kidnapped him. Oh. Oh no. I had no... Yeah. The... If your son is one of them, I can help. You help me. And I'll help you. All right. If I help you, you're going to do something for me. It Come on. Me to know, I think. Sure. All right. First things first. Uh -huh. Yeah, they use some sort of teleporter. Well, well. Not many know about it. Pretty closely guarded secret. You've certainly done your homework. It's commonly referred mm -hmm. dematerialized. The relay is the that means you're uh -huh. no. I don't really know, but it doesn't sound familiar. Not surprising. They don't come out Hello. often. Hello. And when they coursers are institute synths, operations yes, come on. go wrong. They're very good at what they do. Let's go. Just point me in the right direction. Well, mm -hmm. every courser has spent. It's embedded in a chip and. Now I don't know exactly. You're going to have to hunt one down. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's get to work. Right. The primary insertion point. Uh -huh. Now. Come on. The relay. When you get to the ruins, tune it to the lower end. Follow the signal, and it'll lead you to a courser. Then. Uh -huh. Not gonna lie. I. Right, I can't fast travel from in here. It's not very nice, Nick, is it? I'll say I never really use anything like that. Uh, I want to head to Diamond City because I could do with getting some ammo. Well, I'm tired, to be honest. <laughs> but then again, I'm always tired. Booker off Facebook. Not interested. Yeah, I get what you mean. I've tried. Valentine, huh? Good for you. Nick is good people. Uh, you know what I mean. I've tried a couple of times to keep him alive, um, without success. Right, let's wait until the stalls are open. Shouldn't be too long. Check <laughs> it. If you're looking to keep your load light, we can shoot the breeze oh, and come on. pistol or anything else you need. I'll take a look. Sure. Feel free to test the grips. I just want some ammo. Oh, all right. Perfusion cores. That makes a change. Oh no, that's the one. Oh, 
I've got no bloody money though, that's the problem. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Let's sell all my gamma rounds because I haven't got a pla I haven't got a gamma gun. I sell all them. One cap each, seriously. Mhm. Mm Depend. I think it depends on your level. I'm not 100% sure, so don't quote me on that. No! Does because I'm only such a low level and I haven't really gone around collecting a lot of scrap or anything like that to sell. Everyone who's anyone reads public occurrences. You won't believe what's in the next issue. Just you wait. Hey Nat. Hey lady, that interview you did with Piper is really selling. Here's your free copy. Thank you. Right, uh, Let's just head here. I'm saying hello, welcome to the stream. I say it just depends on what you do, really, when it comes to caps. I say I haven't really done much, like looted anything and stuff like that. I haven't got. Oh, is it the scrounger perk? Right, where you get you find more caps everywhere. Oh, well, good afternoon to you. As it's no longer morning here. Then get some loot off there, some ammo off there. Right, let's do. I mean, I know where I'm going. I'm going to Green Tech. No, let's give it a quick save as well. Oh, I'm in the UK. Something out there. I've had someone from America watching, and I've had someone from Australia watching too. Well, let's just go through here. Stop it. First time I've killed someone like that. One, one twenty-two. 
So what we got like five hours difference. Ow! Here we are. Hopefully, we can get some. Right, let's turn that off now. Hopefully, we can get some ammo off the gunners. Uh, save. I do kind of wish to make a. A Fallout game in the UK. I mean, it wouldn't. I don't know how they'd do it because of the law and everything, but. Um. Just try to check your settings. That's the only thing I can think that will help, like the streaming. Like from my side, the streaming quality is all right. Send reinforcements to the lobby in case there are more. PC. I don't think you're alone. I say, aside from checking what your stream settings, What's going on now? How many are we dealing with? I wouldn't know what to say. Well, there's got to be some ammo somewhere. Move, Nick. Who's there? Last mistake. Shouldn't take long. Got him. Made us again. Oh, well, well, glad you glad it's better for you, and I'll have to check, check the those out. Reports of the second intruder in the east wing near the courtyard. Uh, I do need to get into settlement building more the thing that stops me from what really what enjoying it you were smarter than this is how difficult it is to play stuff uh. it really annoys me with like not that it's an option O o my OCD kind of thing. You can't. I can't line things up. 
perfectly and for me that's really irritating Come from. Something out. Come on. No, I hate these bloody terminals. I would have used Nicky if I couldn't. If, if it was. Chuck another try! Oh crap! You are really pissing me off. Well, that's good to know. I've usually always gone with, with sectors two and four. Uh, sanctuary, really. Although the last one I did, I did put some stuff up around oh, the drive-in. Never remember the name of it. Uh, the one that's round here somewhere. Oh, crap! He's paying more attention. Words don't do this place justice, though. Condemned starts to get at it. I didn't mean to pick you up. Legendary one. What else you got? What you got? Uh. You give me some decent weapons.
Bloody hell. Hmm. That's, that's another thing I don't use. I never use stealth, boys, either. That's the one. Who? What the? No. Oh, it's so funny watch, just watching the heads pop off like that. Oh, at least I'm getting some caps out of this. few fusion cells so that's not it's not all bad I suppose I'm coming I'm coming to help Always, always set that off. For once I've remembered about it. Mm. Oh. A little bit that way? No, a little bit the other way. No, a bit more. There we go. Sweet. How many grenades do I have now? Eight. the turret there. Right. Oh, excuse me. Thank you. Kill them all. Oh, shot him in the nuts. Man, you, you really wouldn't walk away from being shot in the nuts with a laser rifle. Don't care who you are, that, you're not walking away from that. Oh, 
save. Master in here. Nick! Hey! Do something for you? Think you can unlock that terminal? Done and done. Goodness. They've got this locked down tighter than a. Uh. Tighter than a what, Nick? Alright. Let's try a slightly different approach. I think there's some fusion cores in it. Nope. Not that either. Sorry, can't bust it. Nick. Hey. I'm all ears. See what you can do. Good plan. Have another go. Locked out of this one. God's sake. I thought you were meant to be the master hacker. I don't know the password. I'm telling the truth. I don't believe. Burn through. You are. Oh God! Please no. <laughs> All he had to do was tell me the password. Now, are you going to cooperate? Oh God! Oh tell God! Me. Okay, okay, just don't shoot! Sweet. Let me think! You obviously don't know. This ends up. Oh, can't be bothered to go through there. Alright, let's heal, save, equip the missile launcher. Just a matter of time. Tell me the password. Look, I already told you I don't. You've been following me. I think I did this last time with a fat man. Lights out for you. No! Anything useful? Nope. I 
Uh, there it is. Oh, another fat man. Don't mind if I do. Use a little help over here. Yes, yes, I'm on it, woman. Thank you. You don't have to say anything. You're welcome. My institute designation is... I knew they'd send it... Oh. I think I would have lost him. Thanks again for your help. And before you ask, the Commonwealth is... Sentinel Power AI. Sorry, Nick. Took too long. Uh, not in this one. Say where to go. Ah, uh, is that the the XO two one, or is it? Am I thinking of a different one? Probably thinking of a different one. Once we get here, I'm gonna go and make myself another coffee, I think. As uh, it's a bit nippy, I might have to turn the heating up a touch. Alright, neighbor. Lowest place in the Commonwealth. Everything not nailed down rolls through here at some point. <laughs> I'll be back in... Actually, we don't need to do that in here, do we? I'll be back in a second. Finn had it coming. We get on the mayor's bad side, you know what's gonna happen.
They must have been crazy challenging Hancock like that. Right on the street. Alright, I am back. Well, hello. Everything here is guaranteed to injure, maim, or kill at your discretion. Except me. I only kill when I want to. Sure. Let's take a look. Each weapon oh, tested yeah. on someone who deserved it. Um. Nah, I think I'm gonna sell my fat man and the missile launcher. I probably won't end up going there to be honest, unless I have to. Let's buy some stuff. I need... Let's sell these as well. Didn't know that. No, I need some shotgun shells. <laughs> now let's get rid of all them. Should have plenty of ammo now for a bit. Brotherhood of steel, but stay out of it. Hmm. To be honest, there's loads of stuff cut from the game, isn't there? You're back. The glowing sea. Virgil. What happened? I found Virgil. He has a way inside the Institute. But I need a code from a Corsair chip. A Corsair chip? You fought a Corsair? Oh my god. Unfortunately, I can't help you. I've worked on a lot of synths, but never a Corsair. I don't know what that chip does, let alone how to decode it. But there are people who might. I work with a group that... Well, they're the only ones I know that even have a chance at cracking Institute security. The they're railroad. called the Railroad. They can't be the only people who can crack a damn code. A pre-war computer chip, maybe you could find someone else. But the Institute is far more advanced. They built the synths, for God's sake. The Railroad's the only group with people who even understand Institute security protocol at the most basic level. You'll need a code phrase to find them. Follow the freedom trail. I'm afraid that's all I have. <sighs> all right. I'll find them. Good luck. I'm sorry what I have is so cryptic. But hopefully you can figure things out as you go. I know where it is, so... It's not the end of the world. It's Deacon!
Plus we'll get to hear what he says about us. Oh. Right. Actually, it's just up here, isn't it? So... Now I've seen a lot of crazy stuff in my time, but a flying ship? Yeah, you can't change nicks apparently. So I've tried. No, where's all the texture gone? That can only mean one thing. Think we're gonna have a crash in a minute. Yep. Yeah, I've done that a couple of times. <laughs> I'll be back in a moment. Just need to reload the game. I might check that out in the, the next playthrough I do because as I say I'm going to try and explore a lot in that one. Do, do. Hello, welcome to the stream. <laughs> I'm not commenting because I don't know. But I will say one thing. <laughs> uh, so far I've put 330 hours into this game. And so I do like finding all the little details and everything, like watching law videos and that kind of thing. Does it cope well on the PS4 with the mods? Cabot House. Hello there. 
Goodbye. I know it's around here somewhere. I'm stuck. Hey, we Thank you, Nick. Now you got I thought there was more than that, yeah. Alright, let's go and talk to Tinkerbell. You can get it through the creation club, I think. Right, um... Huh. It spins. Oh, gone too far. Oh, so it starts with R.
Oh, crap, I'm too far. Oh, wrong way. So that's not right. Ah, oh, Mr. Letter. Ugh, I have to start over. Ah, right. I think I missed the A out last time. There we mm -hmm. go. Stop right there. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting. But before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell are you? Why don't you tell me who you are first? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, and hunters, we're the synths' only friends. We're the railroad. So answer my question. I followed the Freedom Trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? Dr. Amari told me how to find you. Very interesting. Last question. Why are you here? I found a Courser chip. Can your people decode it? You have what? This is not a joking matter. I didn't know we were having a party. What gives with my invitation? Oh, I see you invited the Courser killer. Nice. Deacon, you're late. You're saying this intruder actually killed a Courser? Single-handedly? <laughs> oh, that'd give even Gloria a run for her money. News flash, boss. <clears throat> this lady is kind of a big deal. If you're done interrogating her, you might want to show this coarser murdering machine a little courtesy. <laughs> Just a thought. <laughs> I owe you an apology. Anyone who kills a coarser is good in my book. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. Hopefully, we can work something out. What you're asking for puts us in a tricky position. Yes, we need to let her in. She's got an intact courser chip, for God's sake. That violates our security protocols. To hell with that. She killed a courser. There's no way she's working for the Institute. We're letting you into our headquarters. You're the first outsider ever to be given this privilege. We'll discuss the details about your chip inside. <laughs> Ah, oh, this is the first time I've done it this way. Don't try anything, stranger. Let's just get in there. <laughs> but they've got to go at some point, haven't they? Our visitor here has a courser chip. Whoa! For real? Oh man, it's been ages! Right. Some ground rules. Tom can get you the code, but once he's done, we get the courser chip. Fine. It's yours. All right. Tom, make it happen. All right, little courser chip. To be honest, I don't know if I've got enough. Let's check my ammo supplies first.
Eh, bueno. We're in. Chip accessed. Just poke the analog connectors a little. I mean, to be fair, I could have killed them. Oh man, don't 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 crash. As soon as I together. Memory hiccup. Came in here and just did it myself. Encryption algorithms. All right. Don't try anything, stranger. Oh, Uncle Luke, don't worry. <laughs> they've added more decimals to the last cipher. This is gonna be. Come on, baby. Show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh man, we got lucky. I got you, you institute bastard. I got you. Right, Soft in. Come on. Show me that. Oh, what? What you me die? Thank yeah, you. We got it. We got the code. <laughs> Let me load that onto the hollow tape for ya. Good work, Tom. Hey, yeah, but I'm not sure our luck will hold up next time, Des. Start working on the rest of the chip. And you? I'd love to work with you more. Let me know if you're interested. But to be crystal clear, if you use that data and discover anything involving the Institute, you share it with us first. Otherwise, our relationship will be in jeopardy. Don't try anything, stranger. No, I'm, wor I'm working with the Brotherhood this time. Where's Glory? She's the one I need to do first. And this is still out there, right? Shit, we got company. Hey, what just happened? You trying to get us in trouble? Great. Yes, I am. What are you running away for? Not now. I'll be doing the world a service. Why don't you want to fight back, Pam? I do feel...
Right, I think everyone has been dealt with. So I'm going to take everyone's... Oh, it's a bit late now, Pam's dead. Yes, it was worth it. Because working with the Brotherhood, I'm going to have to come and get rid of them after. Did you win? So, he's the... Uh, leading thing, you know, insane. Where did does his body go? Ah, uh, sorrow. Where is she died down here somewhere? Am I being blind? Ah, there she is. There we go. Right, let's head back up. Oh, what's this video idea? Yeah. I'm listening. <laughs> that may be possible if I play on very easy. Anything useful? Uh, it depends. Pro I may or may not, not 100% sure, so if you haven't finished the uh, game, <laughs> no, that's not going to be possible for me. I'm very bad at this game, as it is, so... No, where do I need to go now? Oh, I've got to go all the way back down there. I suppose I've got to get the plans, haven't I? I don't think I could do that to be to be fair. Uh Mitt and Squad have done now, I think. Thing. I'm not 100% sure, but I think it was Mitten Squad, so I watched the video. Wasn't sure I'd see you again. You managed to get what you need? I have the code. 
Suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? I've made some friends in the Commonwealth. Better you than me. Face like this. I'm not gonna make too many friends. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could. It wouldn't take long. Things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. I do want to try something like that These then. These are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to... Here's the symbol expert. You know the craziest... Uh -huh. All the data's... I want to be clear. I'm sure it'll work. For the record, I haven't made... But... Right. Can you? I mean, can... I've got it covered. Good. Good. Because you've got to make it in there. For book and don't you forget it's yes, my yes, only yes, hope. Yes, 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 yes. go on. T sure. Protect and serve. Right. We need to head to... I'm terrible, terrible with horror games. Uh, I try to avoid them as much as I can. To be perfectly honest. So, I mean, 96 when the first Resident Evil came out, I think I was 12, and I couldn't play that by myself. Just, oh, thingy and Tim. When I get off duty, that's all for steak. And I've played, I have finished the original Resident Evil, uh, 2 and 3, but I've never played any of the other ones after that. And I don't think I ever finished Silent Hill either. By now, I'm sure you've deduced that our arrival in the Commonwealth wasn't coincidental. We're here because of a unique energy reading reported oh, yes, by yes, yes, yes. recon team, according to our scribes. The reading, uh -huh. the moment this information came to light, the Institute. To accomplish this, I've had our school. The only logical... Uh -huh. That's where we need your help. I have a way to infiltrate the Institute. Using a device called a signal interceptor. So it appears we share a common goal. I'm pleased that you've chosen to build the device with the Brotherhood. <laughs> now, indulge me for a moment by satisfying my curiosity. Tell me why you're so eager to get into the Institute. I think... I think they're the ones that kidnapped my son. The Institute preys on the weak to further their own ends. Together, we'll make them pay for their crimes. I'll call ahead and brief Proctor Ingram. Report to the airport, and get to work on your project right away. You disgust me. Not much of a sight yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh. To be fair, when I started, when I first played Minecraft, I did not like going into caves at all. Gridwin is a magnificent ship, and we're lucky to have her in our arsenal. Now, uh, was was a bit of a a mean comeback from Nick, wasn't it? <laughs> Right, where's am I going? Treat your power armor well, and it can get you through anything. Elder Maxson said you'd help me build the signal interceptor. So, looks like you're calling the shots around here now, huh? All right, I'll bite. What does your new miracle device do? The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. 
This machine can hijack their signal and send me instead. Teleportation? Molecular transmission via encrypted RF waves? Okay, even I have to admit, that's genius. This explains why we've been picking up anomalous energy readings all across the Commonwealth. Not to mention how they get their tin soldiers to come out of the damn walls. And this little beauty allows you to literally hijack a return signal. Instead of grabbing the intended target, it grabs you instead. Impressive. Well, you definitely know your stuff. Damn right I do. It's difficult to make out all the details here, but I'm thinking you can get started by building a stabilized reflector platform. It's gonna take a cargo hold full of high-grade metal, but I'm sure that we have plenty of it right here at the airport. Wow. I'm glad you could make sense of those plans. I haven't made sense of all of it yet, but I will by the time you get the first part built. Here's a list of everything you need to find. You're also going to need a massive power source to get the signal interceptor running. All right. He's on the outside. Eh. When it comes to keeping the Pridwin running, Proctor Ingram's the best. No. Thank you very much and glad you've enjoyed it. And I will be streaming again soon, so don't worry. How can I? How do I get around there? Am I being thick? I think I'm being thick, aren't I? Ah, there it is. Ah. Can I just... Oh, I could have just done that, couldn't I? Alright, let's get rid of all this stuff. Oops, missed that. I'm going to leave them there. Ah. No, not yet. I want to get rid of all this stuff first. <laughs> you don't have to if you don't want to. I would appreciate it, but it's your call at the end of the day. Now! Right. <laughs> no, we got to go back to singing, haven't we? Ooh. Any luck building the platform yet? 
Yes, I'm ready to build the rest of it. Good. Let's move on then. Here's a list of everything we'll need. Now, I know some of that might as well be in Greek, so I'll be around if you have any questions. Looks good, Ingram. I'll get to work right away. Hmm. I wish I had your confidence. Oh, one last thing before I forget. It's important that all the components are wired together so all the pieces are on a single grid. Otherwise, this isn't going to work. No. If you need any help, I'll be over at the build site making some adjustments and calculations. I haven't been there yet. I'd wish you good luck, Knight. But I think we're both going to need it. Right, what was... Pretty sure I got some sensor modules back at Sanctuary. Alright, let's just move that. <laughs> right, two, seven, twenty seven, twenty eight. Now, I can only build one. Oh, I haven't got the science rank either. Crap. I'll do with these. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, but you need level four in science. There we go. Remarkable oh, work. What the hell? The signal interceptor appears to be complete. Are you ready to put it to the test? Absolutely. I'm ready to go. Your confidence is an inspiration to us all. That being said, this is the first time we've attempted to directly adapt Institute technology. When we throw that switch, I'll buy have a look at it later. God willing. You'll end up inside the Institute, and the mission can continue. Nothing's gonna stop me when I'm so close to the answers I'm looking for. Eager to get inside, huh? Good. Now, I want you to listen very carefully. Once you've entered the Institute, we expect to lose contact. So it's imperative you remember everything I'm about to tell you. 
About ten years ago, the Brotherhood began recruiting civilian scientists from the Capital Wasteland to assist with various projects. <laughs> During this process, we were able to obtain the services of Dr. Madison Lee, a noted mind in the field of nuclear engineering. That's fortunate. Yes, it was. Securing useful resources during wartime is critical. That said, Dr. Lee's contributions to our cause were instrumental in maintaining order in the Capital Wasteland. After some time, she developed differences with the Brotherhood and exiled herself to the Commonwealth. We're fairly certain that her intent was to make contact with the Institute. I'm surprised that the Brotherhood let her go. Had I been in command, I wouldn't have allowed it to happen. She was a valuable asset. Your mission is simple. Once you're inside the Institute, we want you to track down Dr. Lee's whereabouts. If you find out that she's still alive, Make contact with her and convince her to return to the Brotherhood of Steel. There's a special project. <laughs> Thank you. On, and it needs her attention. What's this project that needs her attention? Sorry, that information is classified. Nah. Uh... I'm sure you understand. Listen to me, Knight. I'm well aware that you're risking your life going into the Institute blind. Just keep your mind on the mission. And don't let anything they say sway you from your duty. Good luck. Ah, yeah, yeah. I've checked and rechecked everything. I think the signal interceptor is ready to go. Are you? Let's do this. All right. Head up onto the platform, and we'll see if I can find a signal to lock onto. The device doesn't work from over there. You have to be on the platform. Uh, I think you'll find I am woman. Let's see. Relays dialed in. Beam emitters warmed up. Everything looks green. From Let fire me start scanning the for the signal. It could Cross your fingers. Our I'm inputting the code now. Yeah, no wow. problem. There's a heck of a lot of interference and ghosting. It's going to take a minute or two to lock in. By the way, this little trip you're taking is a heck of an opportunity to find out as much as we can about the Institute and what they're up to. I put a clever little program on this holotape that'll scan their network and download anything it finds. If you place it in any terminal down there, it'll do the rest. Bring it back to me and I'll see if I can make sense of whatever network it found. Network scanner. Well, well. Looks like we have a winner. RF wave capture complete. Ramping the you emitter. 60%. 80%. Well, what do you expect me to do, Maxon? All that's left is to throw the transmit switch. Transmitting in three, two, one. Stay safe, soldier. Uh, network scanner. Oh crap, 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 crap. Oh, I've took it out. Right, let's... Oh, do we want to do science? Yeah, let's just do the science one. Is it me you're looking for? I wonder if you might make it here. You're quite resourceful. I'm known as Father. The Institute is under my guidance. I know why you're here. I'd like to discuss things with you face to face. Please. No, if we're going to talk face to face, let's take my helmet off. Mm-hmm. It's like Maxine just said to me as well, uh, get a move on. So, I'm waiting. I can only imagine what you've heard, what you think of us. I'd like to show you that you may have the wrong impression. 
Welcome to the Institute. This is the reality of the Institute. This place, these people, the work we do. For over a hundred years, we've dedicated ourselves to humanity's survival. Decades of research, countless experiments and trials, a shared vision of how science can help shape the future. It has never been easy. And our actions are often misinterpreted by those above ground. Someday, perhaps, we can show them what we've accomplished. But for now, <sighs> we must remain underground. There's too much at stake here to risk it all. As you've seen, things above are... unstable. I'd like to talk to you about what we can do for everyone. But that can wait. You are here for a specific, very personal reason. You are here for your son. Sean? Huh? Yes, I'm Sean. Sean. I've been looking for you for so long. Who are you? Sean. Where is everyone? Father, what's going on? What's happening? Those bastards. They... They killed your father. What's going on? Father? Father! <clears throat> I'll kill them for this. All of them. I don't know you. Go away. Father! Father, help me! There's someone here! Help me! Sean, please. Calm down. I'll get you out of there. Father? Father, help me! She's trying to take me! Have you not got to this point Father, in the game? Sean. S923, recall code Cirrus. Fascinating, but disappointing. The child's responses were not at all what I anticipated. He's a prototype, you understand. We're only just now beginning to explore the effects of extreme emotional stimuli. Please try and keep an open mind. I recognize that you are emotional. No. And no, 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 here no, no, has no. been fraught with challenges. Let's start anew. I am father. That's not going to happen. To the Institute. Give me Sean. The real Sean. Right now. I know. I know. You've gone to such lengths to find him. I'll make this very simple. Where is my son? He's here. In the Institute. Closer than you think. But I need you to realize that this situation is far more complicated than you could have imagined. You have traveled very far and suffered a great deal to find your son. Well, your tenacity and dedication have been real. It's good to finally meet you. After all this time, it's me. I am Sean. I am. Your son. Come on. That's crazy. I assure you, I am completely sane. That's and not true. Honest. In the vault, you had no concept of the passage of time. You were released from your pod and went searching for the son you'd lost. But then you learned that your son was no longer an infant, but a ten-year-old boy. You believed that ten years had passed. Is it really so hard to accept that it was not ten, but sixty years? That is the reality. And here I am, raised by the Institute, and now its leader. It wasn't... It wasn't right. 
what they did. Taking you from me like that. To you, that would certainly seem true. But to the Institute, it made all the sense in the world. At that time, the year 2227, the Institute had made great strides in synth uh. scientific curiosity. Right. So they followed the best example thus far. So the weird science experiments needed specimens. That's why they took you? In a manner of speaking, yes. The Institute endeavored to create synthetic organ. Plenty of that was available, even in their attempt. Oh. The Institute found I was exactly what they needed. I am their father. Through science, we are family. <laughs> the synths, me, and you. Sean. It's really you. It really is. I know you must have questions. Please. Anything I can do to help you understand. So, you're in charge of the Institute? I am the acting director, yes. I spent decades working to reach this point. It's a responsibility I take very seriously. The Institute. It's important. It really is humanity's best hope for the future. Uh, no, no matter no. what those above ground do. No, 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 no. It doesn't matter what they think. What matters is what you do. I'm glad we see it the same way. Ultimately, the Commonwealth has nothing to fear from us. Sure. Just what else can I say to ease your mind? I think I've heard enough for now. Very well. The Institute is on the verge of something. I've been a part of something, and now... Yes, that's what I want. I know. I know no you reason. so much. Forgive me. Right. There is much to be done. Uh -huh. I'll do whatever it takes. For no particular reason. I am glad to hear it. The Institute is now your home, as much. You want to introduce yourself. And finally, Doctor. Uh huh. Move out the way, then. No, wrong room. Wrong door. There you go. Wee. Just. <laughs> <laughs> Remember to keep unnecessary power consumption to a minimum. Well, to be fair, the only reason why I named uh, Buffy. Done. Just Excuse me, Doctor. Drive servo. Servo. Really is because I looked at well, names that Codsworth can say. You can think of me as the Institute's chief engineer. When Father told us about, you, if you don't mind my asking, what was it? Mm hmm. I just wanted to find my son. And keep him safe. Now that you've found him, I hope you're... Uh -huh. Now, I'll give you a quick rundown of the... As you might guess, we, right. we maintain yeah. enough... There's mm. a lot of machine... The work we do. Uh -huh. So, now that you're here... And I'm just looking around. I see. Well, please do mind what you touch. Sensitive equipment here. Not like topside. If there's anything else you'd like to know about the facilities division, I'm happy to discuss it. I'm good for now. Thanks. Goodbye then. That's the third primary drive breakdown this month. As far as I'm concerned. Oh, we need to speak one relay to all of them before we can go. You know the protocol, sir. Authorized personnel only. All systems nominal. No worries. Remember to wash your hands. Seriously thinking of heading over to robotics? You're here. Some heads Glad you made it. They're dragging their feet on the Move. Maybe I should take the courses with me. You know, send a message. Mm. Please don't. We're There's all looking forward as it is between with us with and pretty much all the other departments. So, here you are. Just an AO. I'll be up front with you. Mm -hmm. Despite your relation, I'm sure you understand. Why? Don't you trust me? Oh, it's nothing personal. I don't trust anyone. Now, Father has asked that I provide you with a brief... Mm -hmm. Our primary mm -hmm. responsibility... Sure. 
I'm sure it's best. Certainly. I need to keep on their good sides while I'm here. Institute technology. The results could be this. Our main instrument is the course. Coursers hunt. They are highly self-sufficient, trained in combat, infiltration. Well, I gather you know all this. In fact, I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. I'm no stranger to combat. Even so, a courser should be more than a match for any single combatant. I suppose I'll have to ask Robotic to perform Welcome detailed back. diagnostics on the entire production. Mm -hmm. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get I'm good for now. Thanks. Very well. The bolt suit mod. Uh... <laughs> it's not that bad, is it? Nothing to report, ma'am. Right, as uh, no visible reaction to the K fourteen come. Right, we don't want to get to an advanced an system yet. Right, let's see. Can we get the terminal? Should open this. No. <laughs> no, I'm not shooting him yet. Oh, I'm gonna go make myself another cup of coffee. This so I'll be back in a minute. I do love my coffee and plus 
today, Sunday, is the only day when my kids aren't here and they wear me out. So I need all the coffee I can to keep them going. You have time to examine my latest reports on Batch 274? Not yet. I've been reviewing Father's plans to expand our operations at Warwick. Easy. Doc, I wonder how the Warwick welcome. family is doing. So good to have you here. Young Dr. Wally Clayton must be close Holdren, to 10 years old by head now. Head of the bioscience it's remarkable I can't child wait can for you to see the work we're so doing. Long up there, don't it's you think? truly amazing. I'll reserve judgment. In that case, let me give you a brief no. as the name implies. Our most uh -huh. to that end, we cultivate uh -huh. we've even started to explore you probably saw the uh -huh. Yeah. I can't imagine anything <laughs> more exciting than fake gorillas. Speaking only for myself, I find them fascinating. Of course <laughs> I might be a little biased. <laughs> I'm I'm not sure. Uh it's a big decision. In any case, I, I don't I imagine need you'll want to continue anything. Around, or if you I'm good for now. To Thanks. Let Take me know that then. I've got an addiction to coffee. I'm well aware of that addiction. Alright, let's see if we can get through here to get his serum. Mining. Here we go, FEV lab. Sweet. Yeah. Coffee's not too bad as long as you don't go mad. I think I've had three so far today, so I'll balls. So it's not the end of the world. Oh, I'm going to put my helmet back on now. Scanners detecting sentient life. Alert level indicated. Yeah, so when when you're younger, it can be bad. But I'm old. Thirty-seven. Mm -hmm. Ah! <laughs> Just let me in, please. To be fair, I probably do look a bit older than that because of the beard. But it's keeping my face warm in the winter. Mm-hmm. I, I have a lot of stress in my life, to be fair. Why is this so bloody hard? Got it. 
too late. That's, I have to click on the wrong one now. Um, I think it's just those turrets. Oh, there's an assault one in here. I always seem to get legendary ones here. That's not a bad weapon actually. <laughs> Thank you for doing my job for me. That's uh, very kind. I don't think there's anything in these, is there? Ow, oh, cack! Come on! Why am I struggling so much? There we go. Got it. Uh, oh, I didn't. I didn't see that since there. There's the Brotherhood scribe that roams around that you can get to, excuse me, go to your settlement. He sells good armour, I think. But aside from that, uh, I think you got Lucas Miller, is it? He's like one of the wandering traders kind of thing. I think he sells some decent stuff. No, oh, wrong button. Alright, let's go and talk to... Dr. Holdren's synth gorilla project is showing promising results. I mean, that just says everything about the Institute. They want to replace everything. Uh, have I got anything that's going to increase my charisma? Put me on seven. Yeah. 
second aid room. Day tripper. Which right. is normal. Discontinued. That is correct. That was my favorite one. Before we talk to her, we will tank that. What time is it? She's been at it for over two hours. What is she even testing? Nothing. Yeah. At this point, she's just doing it for fun. Dr. Lee. Oh, it's you. You're not authorized to be here. Actually, I was looking for you. Me? Why? I've been sent by the Brotherhood of Steel to find you. You don't beat around the bush, I'll give you that. <laughs> I knew it was just a matter of time before your people would track me down. I've been looking over my shoulder for almost a decade, waiting for them to send someone like you to kill me. I'm only here with good intentions. You have my word. You're giving me your word? Even though we just met? Fine. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Since Father trusts you, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I might not agree with everything he says, but I know he'd never allow harm to come my way. Say what you came here to say, and then leave me alone. Are you happy here? You'd think, being surrounded by cutting-edge laboratory equipment and some of the greatest minds the world's mm -hmm. ever known. So I just took Day Trooper. Only problem is the lack of transparency. I don't think we get the full story on everything that occurs down here. What does that have to do with why we're talking? The Brotherhood needs your help, Doctor. Needs my help? Why? They seem to have everything under control when I left. The Brotherhood valued your presence, and we'd like you to come back. Well, how sweet of them. Tell me something. Why would I possibly want to come crawling back to the Brotherhood? What reason would I have to throw away everything I've accomplished here? Father trusts me, and so should you. He trusts you because you're family. I'm not. I can't just take your word for it. I need more than that. The Brotherhood has always been straight with you. I am getting a bit tired of all the secrets around here. Sometimes I feel like Father isn't being straight with me. Like there are things I'm not supposed to know about. I don't like that. But still, how can I turn my back on all of this? Your work could be instrumental in freeing the Commonwealth. <sighs> you really know how to push my buttons, don't you? You know, I never understood why the Institute was so damn selfish. All those innocent people up there... dying. And here I am, surrounded by technology that could make their lives better. Yet we hide down here and insulate ourselves could from be. everything and everyone. It's not right. It's not right. I'll make my way back to the Brotherhood. But I'm going to have to do it on my own. I can't take any chances being seen with you. Tell whoever sent you that they've just regained the services of Dr. Madison Lee. Now, for the sake of keeping up appearances, let me see that pit boy of yours. I've been told to install a coarser chip in it for you. Father's orders. You're to be given full access, with the ability to relay in and out of the Institute at will. Thank you. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Given that the relay is the only way to access the Institute, <coughs> handy is something of an understatement. In case the significance is lost on you, so you'll say that's why I took day trippers before I started. Access. If nothing else, it should demonstrate the amount of trust Father has placed in you. Speaking of, I trust our discussion will remain between the two of us. Now, I need to get back to work, and I'm sure you have other things to do. Right, it's so new. Is it just. Let's get rid of that. Oh, bugger. No, no, don't want to go to there. Let's just go to the airport. It helps. It puts your charisma, charisma, charisma up by three. 
and something else up by three, but it drops your strength by two. There's some, there's a version of Mentat as well. Is it great Mentat or orange? That helps with charisma as well. Better not let that synth out of your scent. Synths? FEV? Who knows what other sick project he is. Oh, I gotta go back up to Why would you bring that synth here? Aren't you afraid it might be a spy? <laughs> Nikki is not a spy. Here's your holotape, Proctor. Hope the data on that thing was worth it. Thanks. You know, it's good to see you're still in one piece. I wasn't sure what the interceptor would do to you. <laughs> I wasn't worried. After all, I built the device myself. I have confidence in everything I built, too. But that's because I'll only deal with technology that I understand. <laughs> Speaking of technology I don't understand, I'll get this holotape to Proctor Quinlan. I'm dying to find out what's on it. <coughs> Hopefully, it'll oh. reveal a weakness in their defenses. Excuse me. That would be the best case scenario. Before we jump to conclusions, let's see what Quinlan's scribes can get off of it. I'm sure the Institute has all of their data heavily encrypted, so it's going to take some time to crack. After that, we'll have to see what we've got. There's no telling what we might have grabbed off their mainframe. In the meantime, your mission to recruit Dr. Lee still needs to be completed. I believe Elder Maxon gave you all of the details. Good luck, Knight. Right. Let's... Head up to the Pridwin. There's loads of different things you can use and take to boost different stats and whatnot. Alcohol's a good one as well. I think that improves your charisma. Find the technical guy. I received word that Dr. Lee is returning to us. How cooperative do you think she'll be? I've convinced her that the Institute is the enemy, not the Brotherhood. Well done, Knight. As soon as Dr. Lee arrives, we'll interrogate her aboard the Pridwin. She's been under the Institute's influence for the last decade, and we can't afford to take any chances. Mm -hmm. Now, on to other matters. Thanks to the success of your reconnaissance efforts, it's time to advance our operations to the next phase. I want you to report to Proctor Ingram at the airport. She has a special project that requires your immediate attention. Yeah. Once again, Knight. Uh, you, you don't choose... feel too impressed. Dismissed. I think I've actively been doing it for about two years. Something like that. It's some somewhere around that length of time. Hey, Liberty. Hopefully he's not as annoying to follow in this one as he was in as he was in three. Stop the institute for Maxon and for the Brotherhood. Uh, but, but, what are the things I've got? I haven't got anything else at all. Increased charisma at the moment.
So I've been doing it for about two years, consistently, consistently. So I don't know if you just have to wait for a bit of time to pass. Greetings, Knight. So this has been this. I was going to say this has been my best month on YouTube. So I bet by you're far. eager to get your hands dirty on our new project. How much has Maxon told you about it? He seems to feel it's pretty important. Important is an understatement. We're pouring every resource we have into this thing. I hope it's worth it. Come on. It's so in way. terms of views, subscribers gas, gained. Notice that we've been building a gantry on the tarmac. Maxon and Kells have been looking for something that'll tip the balance when we go toe to toe with the Institute. Now the Pridwin might be a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. That's where our new project comes in. Nah, this is why I couldn't open the door. This storage bay full of parts is what's left of Liberty Prime. The brother <laughs> used it in the Capital Wasteland as a weapon against the Enclave. It's the most advanced robot the Brotherhood has ever had at its disposal. Unfortunately, Liberty Prime was destroyed in the line of duty. I've spent the better part of the last few years piecing him back together. And if you think that was easy, try rebuilding a Protectron while you're blindfolded. In order to get Liberty Prime fully operational, we're going to need your help. No problem. I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. Huh. I wish I had your confidence, because this is not going to be easy. Now, the good news is that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. I think it does, yeah. The bad yeah. news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. And the first problem is his CPU. It's fragile, and every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. Hmm. There's got to be a way to solve that. I do all the maintenance on the Pridwin, so you'd think it'd be a snap. As much as I hate to admit it, Prime's power systems are out of my league. Luckily, you were able to convince Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build team for Liberty Prime a little over a decade ago. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with his power system, we can get the big guy moving. No. Right, where is she? Is she on the ship? Yes. Mhm. Mm I mean, when you think about it, it's how did the world get to such a place where Nuclear war was even considered. There's no time to waste when there's work to be done. Well, let's go and repair our armor as well if we can. So this is my first time doing anything Attention. with the Brotherhood. Any personnel who have not completed their annual medical evaluation should report to Knight Captain Gate Captain immediately Kelsey to schedule an examination. Going forward, that is all. Dr. Lee. If you're here to talk me into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget it. You promised you'd help us. You're right, I did. But you neglected to mention that I'd be asked to work on Liberty Prime. I've been down this road with the Brotherhood before. Why would I make the same mistake twice? Because we care what happens to the Commonwealth. You may not like the Brotherhood, mm -hmm. but the people of the Commonwealth shouldn't have to suffer for it. You know, if anyone else wearing a Brotherhood of Steel uniform said something like that, I'd laugh in their face. But coming from you, 
It sounds like you actually mean it. Tell Proctor Ingram mm -hmm. to get her scribes ready. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty broken many back bones. Online, but we'll get it done. Hey, let me ask you something. Sure, ask away. It's just, uh, with everything that's happened with you and your, your family, it's a whole hell of a lot to process. I wanted to make sure you're holding up all right. Yeah, I'm all right. Huh, you're a tougher nut than I thought. Took me a long day. Thank goodness I found oh. diamonds. Of course, when I took up the massacre of plenty of people, at, but at the time. Why'd they let you in? Because I'd read a gal of about the young. Right. Turns out the guy was. I took her home and taking up and. Was it hard settling in? Yeah, they should have. Mm -hmm. I started off, but I guess folk. Wife runs off and upset folk. After a while, hell, I was so happy to do it. It was month. I never stopped being Nick. Uh -huh. It was about then that uh -huh. it took me a long, a long story. Sure. <laughs> Excuse me, Paladin Dance. Ready to continue our mission, soldier? Ready. Roger that. Dance. Valentine. Right, I do need to be able to repair my armor. Right, what do I need? Building something? Ooh. No, we definitely need to be able to repair that. Right. Oh god, mole rat on a stick was a really bad idea. <laughs> Excuse me. Well, don't just stand there looking at me then. Our cause was the wisest decision of your life, sister. Yeah, okay. If you say so. Right, let's go and speak to Ingram. I dance like the fact that I've got in my power armor. I've never had him as a companion before. I'm just trying to get things repaired and stuff at the moment. No, so I haven't got the perk requirements, I don't think, to get to fully upgrade stuff. And I don't see the point of upgrading it until you can do it fully anyway. Because you're just wasting materials. No, oh, Nick does that all the time as well. Ooh, phone's charged. Right, where are you, Ingram? Hey, she's in Brotherhood stuff now. Proctor. Well, things are off to a good start. Isn't that right, Doctor? I hope so. Prime suffered some significant damage to his memory core. I wish your people would have been a bit more careful, Proctor. The good news is that the damage isn't irreversible, and I should be able to get the power flowing into his CPU I core really struggled recording. with that when if I played on my way, very is. hard. Hmm, charming, isn't she? Sorry about that, Ingram. Don't worry about it. Patience. We might be butting heads on a few <laughs> issues, but I've dealt with worse. 
That's all Besides, I can say is patience. Dr. Lee's worth all the aggravation. We're working with one of Prime's original designers. I don't see it getting any better than that. In fact, since things are going so well, we're gonna have you start building as electromagnetic actuators. Sure, anything you need. That's what I love about you. You're ready to leap into action, and I bet you don't have the faintest idea what I'm nope. talking about. The actuators are what allows Liberty Prime's arms and legs to move. That's the only way I could do it. Way too heavy for the simple hydraulic pistons he had in the past. Patience and You're perseverance. Have to those out, construct a brand new system using electromagnets and install them in his limbs. What we need you to do is build the actuators for us. Now that you know what the actuators are, you need to know how to make them. These are the plans and the materials These, list. The brotherhood. Don't lose them. Now, before you get that look on your face, you'll be happy to know that we have plenty of the raw materials on that list right here at the airport. The only thing we need you to head out and find is a high-powered magnet. According to Proctor Quinlan, the best place to find one is in any of the ruined hospitals around the Commonwealth. We've already sent out a few teams to find the rest of the high-powered magnets you'll need. They should be back by the time I'll you answer return. the questions in a moment. Once you start building the actuators, we need one for each limb, so you'll need to make a total of four. Good luck. Alright, as... The only thing I can think with that, like with the Brotherhood, is because that's kind of, it's kind of like an army thing. So... Oh, I've got to go right down there. What's that been highlighted for? Right, where have we got to go? Right the way down south. So let's head to Diamond City. Now I, said, I think that's just a military term. And they see themselves as an army of sorts, so... I'm guessing, not, as I say, I'm not 100% sure, I'm just guessing that that is part of the reason. It's a shame these people have to live in fear. Sheltering in this old stadium when all those perfectly good buildings are still standing outside. Oh, I didn't think that would bring us into Diamond City. <laughs> I thought we'd, we'd uh, appear outside. Oh, load quicker! Ooh! Didn't want it then. All right, come on, dance. Let's go this way. Oh, shut up. No one's coming to help you. Maybe a vehicle of some kind. Sounds like something crash landed. We should investigate immediately. Not right now, Dance. A bit later.
Alright, let's see what locations we can discover on the way. Alright, so I'll get the alien blaster later. Is that a glowing one? No, we're pretty much at the hospital. Nice. <laughs> Let's get weapons loaded. What? Who's that? <laughs> that dealt with them. Ah, look at how they're hugging. Dance shift. Oh, they're not hugging anymore now. Damn sure aiming is terrible. Uh, that's another one, that's another one, run away! Well done. I'll take his mini nuke. Let's not get sidetracked anymore. Mm-hmm. Well, that's three. We just got rid of. Stop whining. <laughs> I, was, I, I was gonna do a playthrough on survival but I don't think I could do it with just the fact of facilities like this were funded by privately owned corporations more interested not, in making a not being able to fast travel but the saving Guess dance, we're the intruders. Oh, back to the usual team. Thought as much. Nothing there after all. What? I've been here. Anxious? Overstimulated? Please stand still. I've had to come here before in previous games and I can't remember what for. <laughs> Another feeling. My youngest has knocked a couple of mine out.
Your cooperation is requested. Dance, where are you? And why aren't you being helpful? I'll take the quantum. It's been a long time since I've sort of seen Fight Club. Second. Oh. Is this where you have to come to rescue Kent? There's the robotics, ex robotics expert, I think it is. This is quite an unusual location. Right, that's where we get back out. Is it not going well? Dance, I have eyes. Basement. Oh, did I didn't. Oh, crap, I'm out of ammo. Run away, run away, run away, run away. if not relentless. <laughs> ah, San Andreas. Need to play that again at some point. I've never owned an Xbox in my life. To be perfectly honest. I only ever you had Playstations, Nintendos and Segas. Thanks for the help, Dance. Uh, 
Alright, let's head back to the airport. I'm gonna speak to Ingram. And she'll appear again. I can't wait to see Liberty Prime in action again. Proctor Ingram? That's all four actuators. Delivered and done. Nice work. Right on schedule. I've completed the restoration of Prime's basic functions and he's ready to go. In fact, it's getting difficult to explain to the system why it can't move right now. Well, as soon as my scribes get those actuators in place, we'll have his arms and legs installed in no time. Which brings me to your next assignment. It won't <laughs> be long before Prime can walk and talk, but he's missing one last important element. His nukes. Without them, his offensive systems aren't operating at peak capacity. Shouldn't be a problem. Just tell me where they are. I wish I could. Prime's bomb pack is fitted for Mark 28 nuclear bombs. The same type of bombs that were dropped from aircraft during the Great War. The Commonwealth was a major staging area for the military's air force, so we assumed we wouldn't have trouble finding them. But since we arrived, our scouting teams haven't located a single bomb. That's going to be a problem. Without a fully loaded nuke pack, Prime won't have the firepower to take on the Institute. She's right. Of course. I don't know. Right. But before you give up hope, to be honest. there's actually a silver lining. Proctor Quinlan has located some records regarding a military installation, which was used as a nuclear weapons storage facility. We're fairly certain this included a stockpile of the Mark 28s. The catch is that the installation is located somewhere oh, within the me. glowing sea. I'll head out there immediately. Good. Because that's exactly what we're asking you to do. <laughs> Scribe Halen's established a communications point on the frontier of the Glowing Sea. I suggest you head out there first, and establish a signal protocol with her so that the nukes can be airlifted out once you've located them. Hopefully, by the time you've returned, we'll be ready to wake yeah, Prime no up and you can say hello. Good luck, Knight. I say I might do it, but... Because I've been streaming nearly six hours now. Ah, oh, there's miles. Right, let's head back to Fallon's. I'll say if I don't finish it uh, in this stream, it, it will definitely be finished tomorrow. Let's let them take out the gunners.
That's not a good thing. This was gunners. Not gonna make this easy for you. Wait, Contact what was that? Hmm. I thought that was that place would be full of gunners. Find some fusion cores soon. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's most kind for you to do my uh, advertising and everything for me. Where'd they go? They're right behind you. Dance! Dance and more help would be appreciated. Give me my weapon! That was another mile out, King. It's a bloody legendary one as well, for God's sake. Do I still have the missile launcher? No, but I have a minigun. Dance!
Let's go down! Oh, yeah, yeah. What did you have? Really? Was it worth it? No, that's boring and cheaty. I need to find a way across the river, across the lake. There's another one over there. Oh, right. We're going a different way, dance. Sure, we can get through this bit of water over here. What the hell was that? Shoot him! Shoot him all! Thought you were running away. All right, he's dead. Oh dear. Now, uh, hopefully, we won't have too much, too many problems now. Well, now there's more lurks down here. Oh, bloody blow flies! That's it. Just as long as they get away from me, I don't mind. I'm a stuck up. Run away, run away, run away. <laughs> yeah, I kind of uh, regretted going that way, to be fair. I don't know if they're, they're going down to help dance. Halen, it's good to see you again, Knight. You've come a long way since you stumbled in the Cambridge police station. <laughs> Thanks, Halen. I assume the place is still in one piece. We're doing the best that we can. 
We've had the occasional synth attack, but so far we've been able to keep them from overrunning us. Thanks to the reinforcements and the air support, I'd say that site was secure. That's not surprising. After all, it's in good hands. I appreciate that. Anyway, I know you don't have time for small talk, so I'll get right to it. I've had the men set up the equipment we'll need to pinpoint you once you've found the bombs. We've rigged up this distress pulser to emit a unique tone that we'll be listening for. When you find the bombs, plant the pulser, and we'll handle the rest. After that, you should probably head back to Proctor Ingram and bring her your report. Doesn't sound too difficult. Ah, oh, no. Not at all. You're only heading back into the most inhospitable place in the entire Commonwealth. Look, I know you've been through the glowing sea before, but remember to keep an eye on your Geiger counter. If you don't, the radiation will cook you from the inside out. Good luck, Knight. Right, Sentinel site. I have been and explored this place on a different character. <laughs> well, it depends on what kind of spoilers you don't want, really, because this is going to be the Brotherhood ending. I can't, I don't have any. Oh, excuse me. Discover this. I have to get in dropping through the top, then, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I don't think there's anything worthwhile down there, to be honest, so I'm going to leave it. <laughs> I know that feeling. Right, we'll get to this place. And then I'm going to make another coffee. Alright, here's one plane wreckage. Oh no, I pressed the wrong button. Get back in. Oh, it's a vertibird wreckage. Tough in this game. In three, you could. I think you had your health meter and you had the rad meter. They were separate, I think. But in this one, they're all. It's just the one thing you said. The more rad you get, the less health you have. Oh. 
no, 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 no. Why me? I didn't start shooting. Okay, it wasn't me who aggroed you. The slew. Why is there an eyebot over here? Right, we're getting close because it's showing up on the radar now. <laughs> Darren's is not there anymore. Well, these are so much worse than in the ones in three in New Vegas. Oh. Right, how far back have we got to go? No, because that kind of thing happens, even in power armor. Alright, let's see where we are. Oh, Alright, I'll uh, back in a minute, I'm gonna make a drink.
right on back. The last person that disobeyed Captain Kelsey ended up scraping rust off the Fridwin's hull from the outside. Right, I think. Yes. Um. Well, let's do this one. Right, now we've got to avoid that bloody thing where the Milo Kings were. Oh no, we've gone past that, haven't we? Oh, that's alright. So I thought we'd gone back further than what I had. Oh. Right, I might get this done. And then have a break for an hour or so. We'll have some food. And I may pick the stream, start streaming in a bit later. But we're going to get this done first. Plus I'm starting to get a bit of a headache as well. <laughs> I've no idea. There you go, stop lagging behind dance. I'm stuck! <laughs> Thought that was a death claw then, hunched over. But no. Quick save. Someone else here you can attack. Jesus. There's the mud chops. Oh. 
Get it. Thank you for finally helping. Ooh, yes. That is a good shotgun. I just have no shotgun shells. Right, I'm saving it now. It's almost as good. Actually, no. It's nowhere near. Oh, Jesus! Where the hell did you lot come from? Yes, Dance, this is the correct place. Interested in that one. I'll bother about blacksmith. Let's actually no, let's put it in if this is a bomb disposal facility. Hopefully, not always. I did that earlier when we were looking for the Corsa. Didn't really bother him too much. silo as well. Right, there's a magazine in here somewhere. There it is. Excellent. Let's just step yeah them doors. We don't need to open those at the moment. Something doesn't feel right around here. Uh, you don't say, Dance. Crap. Sweet. Oh, 
Oh, I need some ammo. I mean, I probably could have just jumped down. But if I'd have done that, I wouldn't have to get back up. I hear something. You coming up? I can't remember where you gotta go. Ah, it's through this pipe. Have I got any grenades left? Yes. Actually, let's drop. Remain vigilant. I know there's still here. Yes, dance, I heard it. How am I going to get down? Go over there. I'm worth it. <laughs> Make sure it's dead. Children of Atom. Really not surprised that they got it. Here, really. Ooh, full tech lunch box. What's what we got? Ooh, protector model. Right, let's equip this, these grenades again. It's a nuclear grenade. That's going to be fun to use. There. Get 
Good work. Don't leave anything behind. I don't plan on it. All right, let's go the other way. Two hundred and forty-eight. Hey there. State your purpose, stranger. You walk on Atom's hallowed ground. I'm looking for some bombs. Nuclear bombs. The children of Atom have sworn to guard this place until the time of the Great Divide. None shall enter. I see. Talking to you is pointless. All your petty deeds will become pointless when Atom returns. When the Great Divide cleanses this world and all in it, you will leave this place or face Atom's wrath. All right, Nutjob. This is your last warning. Show me the nukes or else. No! Your time on this world has ended. Face Atom's wrath and despair. Ambush. Ambush. The no defense is engaged. Mm-hmm. No, oh, there's no quick way to get down there. Now that this site's been secured, you should return to the airport immediately. Mm -hmm. I'll remain on watch until the vertebrates arrive. Good idea. Wouldn't want these things falling into the wrong hands. Exactly. I'll meet you aboard the Pridwin. As soon as these bombs are counted, tested, and loaded. Outstanding work, Knight. And how are we going to test them? Really? Uh, if only there was a closer exit. When we get back to Thingy, the airport, we'll talk to Ingram, and then I'm going to have a break for a bit, I think. Oh, it's just a bottle. Oh, 
Right, uh, where did I come in? It was over here, wasn't it? Nope, nope, wrong way, wrong way. Now I'm going to have some food. <laughs> they pit everywhere. Ooh, door, I didn't see that last time. Oh. There's nothing in there. outside oh thank you very much all right let's head back to airport talk to Ingram get this mission finished then I'm gonna call it a day for a bit have a break have some dinner And I might stream again a bit later. No, yep, I'll probably have a break for about an hour and a half. <laughs> so what time is it now? I'll pass four, so about six o'clock. I'll probably stream again for another couple of hours. Once we've uh, got through this loading screen, obviously. Dr. Ingram. Looks like the Mark 28s are going to do the trick. That was a good find. I'll work with your team to ensure that Prime's bombs remain stable after they're loaded into his pack. It won't be too much of a problem. Well, Dr. Lee, I have to admit, we couldn't have done this without you. Hmm. It's a little early to begin celebrating, Proctor Ingram. We haven't fully thrown the switch on Liberty Prime, and I'm just hoping all the work I've done to keep his system stable are going to hold. I have full confidence in everyone's abilities here. I appreciate that. Proctor, all the readouts look green. I think it's time for you to perform the power shunt. Actually, I think I'm gonna let you press the button. After all, without your help, we'd still be staring <coughs> at a pile of disassembled parts. It would be better if a trained technician performed that task, but I suppose you deserve to be the one to do it. Thank you. Liberty Prime, back online. All right, let's run a basic diagnostic on him. Diagnostic command accepted. Give him a moment. He needs to adjust to his new configuration. Voice module online. Audio functionality test <laughs> initialized. Designation Liberty Prime, Mark what? 2. Mission. The liberation of Anchorage, Alaska. I try to engage with everyone because any and all red Chinese invaders. You gotta build a community and everything. Analysis of the battle readiness check. Liberty Prime. Full system analysis. All systems. Nominal. Weapons. Hot. Warning. Nuclear weapon payload depleted. Reload required. Warning. Power core offline. Running on external power only. Core restart recommended. Ability to repel red Chinese invaders compromised. <laughs> I've got green lights across the board here. He's looking good from where I'm sitting. Doctor, if you wouldn't mind keeping an eye on the big guy here, I'd appreciate it. Well, I have to admit, I wasn't sure we'd be able to pull it off, but Liberty Prime's looking pretty good. With him on our side, I don't see how the Institute even stands a chance. I couldn't agree with you more. 
Before you head off to your next assignment, I have something for you. I came up with this little beauty myself. I think it'll add a bit more punch to your power armor. Ooh. You didn't have to do that, Ingram. <sighs> Come on. You earned the damn thing. Besides, Liberty Prime isn't about to run out and get you a gift. <laughs> anyway, that's enough of that. You better hightail it up to the Pridwin. Elder Maxson said he needed to speak to you as soon as you were done here. And thank you, Knight. Without you, none of this would have been possible. Right. I am going to save it now. And have a break. Oh, for an hour and a half. Have some food. And whatnot. So, yeah. Thank you everyone for watching. If you've enjoyed it, please do leave a like. And if you really enjoyed it and want to see more, hit that subscribe button. And I'll catch you all in the next one. So, thank you everyone for watching. And goodbye.